Hey guys, how are we? How are we? How's everyone doing? Let me go through and say hi to everybody. Um, let's see. Hi, Darla. Congrats on getting first. Hi, L. Hi, Tapur Hunter. Uh, hi, K Dawn. Hi, Tabby. How are we? How are we? Hi, Duck Duck. Hi, K Vogel. How are we? How's everyone doing today? Um, Bellabot is still not with us. I have been trying with Obi with um with what you call with uh stream elements to try to get her sorted, but so far no response from stream elements. So we'll see. So yeah. Uh, but for the time being, we're not gonna have Bellabot. So call you Tupper. All right, I will do that. Um, I'm doing good. Appointment went good. I got new plugs in my eyes, so, um, my eyes shouldn't be nearly as dry. He's not happy with how dry they were, um, but we kind of knew that going in. Like, we knew it was going to be a problem. Um, basically, if we had waited two months after they diagnosed me with dry eye, uh, before we did the surgery, it would have been fine. Um, but we didn't have that luxury because my eyes were basically attacking themselves, so... Um, yeah, the infection is completely gone, so no more infection. Um, it's just, we, my eyes are not, my eyes are just, like, drying out too fast. So, he gave me plugs that will last much longer. So, this time, instead of 30, instead of three weeks, it's now six months. So, also, we have a tail. What you doing? Hey, what you doing? You just looked up at me. Oh, uh, yeah, thank you. Yeah, it's just a matter of um, basically just putting in extra eye drops. I'm on three different eye drops now, so I mean, at this point, I'm kind of used to it. Yes, you're my good boy. You're my good boy, I know. He's mad right now. He's mad right now, so. I know. Uh, basically, so my mom took me to my appointment this morning. And um, she didn't come in when she dropped me off. Because she'll be back later. Because she had to go run a few errands first. So, yeah. And yes, we can't give him a roaster. Um, but yeah, so he's mad because his grandma came to the door. And didn't come in and didn't come play with him. So, I mean, it. she's going to be back and he's going on a walk in like an hour. She just had to, she just had another appointment she had to go to. So, I mean, we're trying to teach him that just because they show up does not mean they're here to play with him. So. Here we go. Thank you. Thank you. You're my good boy. I know. I know. Ow. Thank you. As I get slimed. What do you got? What'd you get? Did you get your Game Boy? He's in, he's in a mood. He's in a mood right now. So. We'll see. But yeah, so. If you hear him squeaking or barking, he's just in a mood, so. But, yeah. Alright, well. I'll have to keep that up just in case they answer me on how to fix her. I was hoping he wouldn't find that one. Alright, he's out of the room. All right, so, yeah, I think, yeah, I don't think we have anything else really big going on other than flavor of the day, and, um, and Tupper, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the cabana. Grab a drink, grab a lunch, share, and get comfy. So, yeah, we just have flavor of the day and bingo, and then we can hop into Sims. And uh, not a problem, not a problem. Yeah, um, it's basically, I had eye surgery in... February and we're just still I'm just still healing from it. So it is what it is um, But we're getting there. 
we are getting there. So, um, but yeah, go ahead and do your flavor of the day. And then, um, if we are ready for bingo, O slash if we are ready for bingo. Oh, I know what it was. Apparently, they just released a, um, fix patch. So, and... Oh, and thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the cabana. Grab a drink, grab a lunch, share, and get comfy. Um, let me see what the patch notes say really quick. Oh, hold on. Why am I trying to look on the EA's website? Where is... Where is Sims resource? Not resource, Sims community. Because they always have the, the T on what to expect. Um, all right, here we go. The new updates. Um, patch notes incoming. Okay, so they haven't released those yet. So, yeah. Um, and if you're on the computer for a bingo, you'll just hover over this way. Um, and that's where the bingo will show up. And then you'll click that, cl click grab free bingo. So, and hi, Steph. And hi, Duck Duck. And, uh, Kadon. I already said hi to Duck Duck. Yes, I did. I, yeah. I don't know. But, okay. So, this is supposed to fix a lot of the wedding errors. So. All right. I'll believe it when it happens. I'll believe it when it happens. Yeah. All right. Um, so I, I have an order out for emotes, so we'll see. Um, the person that I order from, I ordered them from is backed up, so we'll, we'll see. Yeah, we'll, we'll see how, we'll see when they can get to us. Um, animated ones I have to order from a different person. Um, so, yeah, we'll see. But, alright. Oh, uh, well, the thing ended, so yeah, we can do the, um, we can do the, um, prediction for re that real quick. Gotta find it. I lost power three times last night, and one of those times I was on the computer, so, yeah. All of my stuff didn't save, so I had to reopen everything in a scramble today. So, all right. Summary. Okie dokie. So, 37% said pink, and 63% said yellow. So. Can we help you, sir? Can we help you? Yes, you're cute. We know it. Everybody knows it. I know. I know. Yeah, I know. You're very cute. You're very cute. Fearsome, hello. And hi, Adelina. Hi, Sam. He's just very... I don't know today. I don't know. We're just going to have to deal with it, I think. I think we're just going to have to deal with it. He's just... He's being himself. Um, But... That's his Panta. So... Yeah, for those coming in, Bellabot is still out of commission. I've put a ticket in to get try to get her fixed. We'll see. We'll see if they reply or when they reply. So, I don't know. But for the meantime, we're stuck with Stream Elements. So, I am sorry, guys. 
We just won't have the emotes today. So, but yeah. Um, but anyway, all right. So let's do flavor of the day. Got to reopen everything. All right. So for our flavor of the day today, and yes, I am shorter than normal. It's okay. Our flavor of the day today is pink. It's watermelon wave. I won't get my replenishment until after stream. So we're drinking what I have. But if you said pink, then you won today. Congrats. Congrats. Who got the most points back? Frost did. Gambled 1,000. Got 2,668 back. Congrats. Congrats. So, yeah. Today's going to be a little bit of a shorter stream because um, my eyes are still a little bit sore because I had to use so much numbing drops. Oh, my gosh. Um, so the light does kind of bother me a little bit. So, um, stream is going to be a little bit shorter than normal. Um, and it's just give my eyes a break from the lights. So, um, and hi, Paul. How are you? How is your day going? All right. I'm seeing you guys are ready for bingo. So we'll go ahead. We'll just hop over into bingo as I'm opening 50 million things. All right. Bingo time. All right, O slash if you have your card and you're ready to go. O slashies if we are ready. All right, I'm seeing O slashies and I'm seeing a dancing squirtle. All right, that's good enough for me. Okie dokie. Fearsome, you are the chosen one. Good luck. All right, our first one is Metapod. Arbok. Geodude. Snorlax. All right, great, Duck Duck. Thank you. Psyduck. Pinsir, Jolteon, Farfetch'd, Charmeleon, Vulpix, Pidgey, Onyx, Ammonite, get your Wyatts in chat. Primeape. Mr. Mime. Aerodactyl. Marowak. Jigglypuff. Hitmonchan, Meowth, Diglett or Potato, Zapdos, Gyarados, Weezing, Moltres, Right on. Machop. Bingo. Oh, we got a bingo. All right. All righty. Way to go, K Don. Does anyone else have a bingo? If you were one away, put rude. If you were one away, put rude. Yep, lots of roots, lots of roots. All right, all right. Okie doke. Okay, so. Looks like we have just the one.
All right, so K-Don, congratulations. All right, so there you go. There you go. So, the leaderboard. Am I just not seeing you on the leaderboard? Oh, there we go. Okay, so you are now tied with Claire, Captain, and L for 15th. So, all right. There we go. I was going to say, it didn't want to show for some reason. Hmm. Let's see. Kenzie and Kay Vogel are still tied for number one. They're still tied for number one for the month. But Kenzie is number one overall. So, all righty. Um, let me see. Did they update this post with the patch notes? They did. All right. All right. So these are the these are the bug fixes, guys. My wedding story seems to be the biggest thing. Oh, it looks to be the only thing. All right. Uh, we fixed some issues with ceremony activities not working properly during vow renewal reception and wedding ceremony parties. Sims will be able to go up and down short, medium, and long aisles now during the gather at aisle interaction. All right. Partners will show up for wedding events now. Okay. Um, Sims will no longer set their bouquet aside before walking down the aisle. Ring bears and flower pals will no longer refuse to walk down the aisle after running any interaction from the ceremony activities. Okay. We adjusted our recipe for wedding cakes so they should last much longer, and we made them vegetarian safe. Good. I don't know why they wouldn't have been unless you chose, like, a meat cake. That feels like it should have been gone without saying, but okay, whatever. Um, everyone be excited for our cake and dessert at wedding ceremonies now. Okay. Wedding guests and officiants will gather at the aisle properly now. Okay. Cut the cake with sim interaction is no longer available on cakes that were already cut. Officiants will not just stand there any longer, but will actually do their efficient job. Okay. I didn't know this, this bug was a thing, guys, but apparently this one is. Um, spouses who bend their spouse when performing a spousal kiss will no longer rub their ear into the other sim's face, but will use their lips to kiss their spouse instead. I don't think I ever saw that happen, but okay. Um, and hi, Lumul. Um, so Duck Duck, I did see the sim guru Nick was requesting additional save files. So my guess is that they were not able to fully replicate it to, um, cover all all instances of it that or we're getting another patch very soon so all right some curtains have been updated to cast a slightly less dramatic shadow and placed indoors all right uh sims will react more appropriately when running romantic socials while slow dancing um added some clarity to the tooltip of wedding cakes by including further details about eligible spots uh, Sims will receive the not selected as a Sim of Honor or wasn't invited to the wedding sentiments only when appropriate moving forward. Uh, Let's Get Drinks is no longer available for child or tea Sims on bars. All right. Engaged couples will no longer be able to perform wedding related actions on wedding cakes they don't own. Sims will cut their wedding cakes even if it has a cake topper. They will simply remove from the cake and place in the inventory. Okay. And also, sadly, cake toppers will no longer be floating above the cakes. Uh, when selecting guests in the wedding event planner, it will show all sims that are related to both individuals of the couple now. So guests should no longer get uninvited after editing the guest list with a sim who is not the original host for the event. Both couple sims will be considered the host now. That, okay, that should have already happened, but okay. 
Guest attire, dress code, and color will no longer reset after editing a wedding event. Simmers will be able to choose which aisle the Sims should gather at, and Sims gathering for recessional will be able to go up and down the aisles without issues now. Okay. Because that was a pain in the butt. Uh, we taught Sims some manners so they will properly pay attention to toast now. Alright. Sims with a larger backside will no longer experience their derriere clipping through a certain top. I'm really sad I didn't see that happen. Uh, when engaged Sims perform, perform the exchange vows and kiss, or the exchange vows with officiant and kiss ceremony event, Sims will complete both interactions now and will no longer forget the spousal kiss. Thank you, because that's what we had issues with. Okay, so more sunshine and Tartosa moving forward. Good, because it rained every time we try to go. Um, the Fishians will now give the wedding couple their full attention and avoid talking to other Sims during the speech. Okay. Sims will wear their existing formal outfits for weddings if it's appropriately colored. For engagement dinner, Sims will wear their party outfits and for wedding reception and the vow renewals, they'll wear their formal outfits. Okay. We caught some mischievous gnomes who added super glue to wedding chairs, causing Sims to be unable to get up after taking their seats. We cleaned those chairs meticulously and advised gnomes to be more prudent so Sims would be able to get up to do other re wedding-related actions after sitting down. They had to add the gnomes in somewhere in the patch notes, guys. They had to. At least they actually added it in as a good joke. So we added some musical backdrop to accentuate important wedding moments. Ooh, okay. And arms should no longer clip during dancing. All right. All right, so, should be interesting. Um, okay, no, they did address, uh, Duck Duck, they did address the save bug. Uh, they're actively investigating and will provide an update in the coming weeks. Um, and they're asking that you continue to report instances on Answers HQ. So, yeah, that tells me that they, when they fixed the error bug, um, inadvertently that may have caused another issue, so... Yeah. That's my guess. So, yeah, all right. Well, none of this is going to help us today, but it should help us going forward in our other saves. So, and yes, we did add a sim to this. We did add sims to save files. That is a nice new one. Why is it doing that to me each time I it's weird. Okay, whatever. Oh, it might not be. Okay. I think I know what why it did that. Um, but yeah, so you can you guys are now going to have to choose between adding your sim self to the save file or getting the super secret role. So, yeah. All right. All right, all right, all right. Yeah, they didn't test they didn't test it because it wasn't finished. So it wasn't ready for release. It wasn't ready for anything and they did it anyway. So Yeah. All right. And Frost, hello my dear. All righty. Let me pull it up. I forgot to open it. Why do you have to save again, Sam? What happened? Confusion. All right. Let's go with a... Go with this. No. All right. Oh, I need... 10. All right. So, okay. We're going to do a quick never have I ever and then we will pop into pop into the game. Oh, oh yeah, uh, Sam, the mods are already in it. Yeah. So you you don't have to worry about that. This is the one where the mods are in it that I have to build you houses. So, you are in um uh, Henford on Bagley. Yes. Uh, mods, if you want to change what world you're in, just let me know. 
So, all right. Never have I ever. How this works is I am going to give you 10 options, 10 questions. And, um, yeah, so I'm going to give you 10 questions, 10 never have I ever statements. You tell me how many you've done. Okay. There is a winner to this, but I'm not going to tell you until the end how you win. So change you to Tartosa. Okay. Uh, can you put that in discord? Cause I will forget. Please and thank you. All right. So never have I ever accidentally mixed up salt and sugar on my food. Never have I ever told a joke and nobody laughed. Never have I ever put peanut butter on a dog's nose. Never have I ever cried so hard I started laughing. Never have I ever played a practical joke on my friends. Never have I ever tried to fake my report card. Never have I ever started a funny rumor. Never have I ever participated in a school prank. Never have I ever tried a, a YouTube or TikTok challenge and failed miserably. Never have I ever covered a wall with crayons. So, mixed up salt and sugar on your food, told a joke and no one laughed, put peanut butter on a dog's nose, cried so hard you started laughing, played a practical joke on your friends, tried to fake your report card, started a funny rumor, participated in a school prank, tried a YouTube or TikTok challenge and failed, or covered a wall with crayons when you were little. All right, so how many, how many... How, what's your number? Yeah, what is your number? All right, three, three, five, four, six, three, two, seven, four, two. Y'all, you guys are all over the board. Three, one, all right. All right, which was the one you did, 007? How many did I do? Uh, let me look. Five. I've done five. I've done five. No, you don't have to be little. No, I mean it. If you've if you've done it recently, um. How'd you get away with it? Please tell me. We need to know these things. All right. So in order to get points on this. Oh my gosh. I did not realize. I, I, wow. Okay. I need to brighten my face up even though it hurts my eyes. Okay. Maybe not. Maybe not. We're just going to keep me small camera. We're going to keep me small camera so I can turn the lights down. I may even have to turn these off at some point today just because my eyes are really sensitive. Um, but, okay, so the way to win for this round is uh, whoever had the least amount. So that would be a 007. So congrats to 007. You get popcorn for that. I don't remember. How many did I say? And Luke, hello, how are you? Can we get a shout out for Luke, please? I gotta, I've lost it. Oh, there it is. Five thousand. All right, you get five thousand. All right, so there we go. There we go. Even though the bot's not working. Thank you, Frost. All righty. So, thank you for that. I'm doing good. I'm doing good. My eyes are hurting a little bit. So, like I said, our earlier stream's probably going to be shorter than normal today because, like, it's super hard to see. Um, and I like it hard to see. It's like just light is evil. Yeah. That's what I'm going with. Light's evil today. It says the person who lost power a bunch of times last night. Go figure. But, I mean, they put a bunch of, like, 
I, I don't know how to describe it. They it's basically like they tortured my eyes at the eye doctor. That that's the best way to describe it. Best way to describe it is they tortured my eyeballs. My poor eyeballs. My poor, poor eyeballs. So, it is what it is. Yes, I did. Yes, I did. We just went over the patch notes. I'm surprised. I'm surprised at all the bugs that they acknowledged. So... I say give it Yeah, I say give it an hour before people come up and and find new bugs. Mhm. Mm but I mean when literally everybody's coming out saying that it's an unplayable pack and telling people do not buy it. Like we knew they were going to fix the bugs or as many as they possibly could get away with but i didn't expect them to do that many in the first big patch for it i was expecting us to get like five or six mini patches not a big one but i also have zero faith so it is what it is but all right let's take a quick inventory is mom pregnant Yes, mom just got pregnant. Oh, that's right. We did the 50-50 right before we finished. All right. Okay. So then we have Tiffany who failed and did not age up. I'm still kind of annoyed by her. Um, And then we have Tigger who also failed. Did not age up as they were supposed to. Then we have Cujo who is tired. Who's having to sleep? Who's not going to get to go to go to school tomorrow? Can you potty? You can't potty, but you can wake up and potty train your child. There we go. Uh, there are quite a lot of video reviews and rants about the wedding pack bugs. Yeah, there was. It was literally everywhere. It was literally everywhere. Uh, potty help from mom because mom's closer. It was. Yeah, it was not a good, not a good look for them. Because, like, they've released broken and buggy packs before. I mean, like, Bust the Dust is the perfect example of that. Um, but they spread the fixes for Bust the Dust out over multiple patches. They didn't dedicate a patch specifically to one pack. Because as far as I saw on the patch notes, that was the only pack that they did updates for. They didn't even fix some base game up it bugs. So, yeah, it, to me that says that, uh, like what someone said earlier, they didn't finish the pack. So, now they're finishing it and releasing the rest of it. But it probably was honestly through no fault of the gurus. So, do not blame the gurus for it at all. Um, and Dad Girl Zoe, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the cabana. Grab a drink, grab a lunch, share, and get comfy. They're just doing what they're being told they have to do. So... Having worked in corporate America, I I have a, a, a greater amount of respect for what they have to put up with than what I did before I worked in corporate America. Uh, bust the butt is still broken. You get dust, buddy, dust bunnies with the dust system turned off. Yes. Yes. Um, but, like, the main reason I never bought Bust the Dust was not because it's broken. No. It's because I hate vacuuming. I don't do it IRL. I actually got yelled at for that yesterday. No, it was yesterday. It was two days ago. I don't know. Whatever day my mom was last year, I actually got yelled at for not vacuuming enough. So if I have to get yelled at as an adult for not vacuuming, what makes you think I'm going to vacuum in game? I'm not. And hi, Angel Mama. How are you? And hi, gaming. Yes, the gurus get so much hate and they do not deserve any of it. Yes, they were. they'll promote the packs and they'll promote stuff and they are trying their best but their hands are tied they can only do so much no i don't want a job they're, yeah they're only able to do so much before they're basically hitting a brick wall so yeah you're honestly surprised there isn't some manager being fired because of all the crazy stuff going on at ea 
I would not be surprised if there was restructuring going on that we just don't hear about. Because there's been some sudden changes with EA. So that makes me feel like there was some sort of change. How that'll affect Sims, who knows. But Maxis did just revamp itself. So it could be a Maxis thing, not an EA thing. But honestly, we'll never find out. Unless somebody decides to spill the tea. It would be nice to have debug vacuums and stuff for looks. Yeah. Like, give me a debug vacuum. For sure. For sure, I would use a debug vacuum. I'm just not going to vacuum myself. Absolutely not. And hi, Sim Christina. How are you? I hope your day is going well. All right. We just became good friends with Layla. Good. How are you on sleep? Oh, uh, I'm going to wake you up. You're going to go slide. Yeah, we're going to have you go slide. Wake up and go slide. There we go. Uh, with the work, you pushed back an internal relaunch of a program two months because it wasn't ready. Uh, yeah, I think it was just timing. I, I think that the pack was just for the wedding pack. I think they were trying to release it with Valentine's Day, but it didn't come out. And I think if they... Honestly, what they should have done is they should have announced it. And then... Um, like, they should have leaked it on Valentine's Day. And then finished working on it. And then released it, like, three weeks later. Like, do an abnormally long leak. Or something. So. Uh, same reason you never really wanted the laundry pack. I actually like the laundry pack. I was surprised. I hate doing laundry. Like... Y'all don't want to know how many times I have to rewash my clothes because I put it in the washer and then I forget about it and I find it two days later and they're gross smelling. But that's more because I, I have terrible short-term memory. But it takes me a long time to do laundry IRL. Uh, and yeah, it takes me a while to do laundry in game too. But I also think it's fun because it's like, I don't know, they fold it for you. And Marsmoon, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the cabana. Grab a drink, grab a lunch, share, and get comfy. Oh, uh, you're on day three of being sick. Oh, no. I'm sorry. Up, oh, up, oh, up. Oh. Are we puking? We're puking. All right. And we're not listening to that because that'd be gross. Oh, you're so close, kiddo. You are so close. All right. When you're done, come back here. Potty train her again. Nope. You are not allowed. Get out. Get out of there. Get potty trained. Okay, thanks. Oh, uh, you set a timer on your phone when you put laundry in now? I need to start doing that, honestly. I, like, you guys see a little bit of it, but I am honestly one of the most forgetful people you will, you will come across. And it's not because I don't care. It's because you can tell me something and I will literally forget it within a few seconds. Uh, Teenage Miss, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the cabana. Grab a drink, grab a lunch, share, and get comfy. That's why I have a reminder channel in the Discord. And the mods have to remind me to do stuff. I'm sure I irritate the mods to some degree. Because they have to keep reminding me of stuff. A kind of. A kind of. It's like some things I can easily remember. Other things I'm like, wait, what? Like I can forget what you're saying mid-sentence. And then I get too embarrassed to ask for clarification. So, and hi, Cindy, how are you? It just depends on the day, really. It really does. Um, you hate doing laundry too, at least putting it away. Yes, yes. Like, I have a basket of clothes on the, on the couch right now. They're clean. Like, don't, don't get me wrong, they're clean. They just need to be folded and put away. Um... Because I hang dry all my shirts on a clothing rack. So those are, I can easily hang those up. Because I'm not coming on stream with wrinkly shirts. That's just, no. I don't care if my pants are wrinkly because, like, y'all don't see those. Um, it's like the business on top part, like, sleepwear on the bottom type thing. Um, but when it comes to anything else, it took me, how, what was the longest it's ever taken me to fold clothes? 
I want to say like three or four months. No, I take that back. It was almost five months because that was when I was living in the dorms. Yeah, yeah. If I dug back into my social media and I actually found the um, password to my Facebook, I could probably find pictures of it. Because my dorm mates were mean. They would take pictures of my laundry piles. Woo! Sorry about that. I felt that coming and then it just hit. Oh, uh, your dog keeps stealing your slippers. Oh, no. Thank you, Darla. Yeah, uh, Paul used to steal slippers. He used to. Thankfully, he doesn't anymore. But it was very frustrating. Okay, you little snot. Eat your fish tacos. And then go... Then... Yeah, it's too late now. So just go to sleep then. All right. I'm just looking around to see what our kids need. They don't need much. Oh. Wait, who died? Oh. Grandkid died. That's what it was. Oh! Also, too, guys. If you have not seen, there is a new TikTok that was posted. So, if you have not checked that out, um, please go and do so. I think you'll enjoy this that the one from today. Yeah, I think you'll enjoy the one from today. So, yeah. Hold up. Wait a minute. The one from yesterday just exploded. I looked at it just a little bit ago. And it wasn't even... It was, like, really low. What the heck? Alright, then. Alright. TikTok be weird, man. TikTok be weird. Wait, the one from today? The what 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 one came up on your FYP? Cuz I'm I'm trying to figure out the algorithm to see what they what it likes and what it doesn't like. So yeah, let if you guys ever see me on uh your FYP, let me know, please. I would love to hear that. And I'm Allison. Thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the Cabana. Grab a drink, grab a lunch, share and get comfy. Wait, where are you going? Did you did you potty at all? Kind of. No, go sleep in the tent. Go sleep in the tent. Clean that up. Clean that. Clean that. I'm going to send him to go talk in a kid's chat room. Even though that was what we were told growing up was dangerous. Don't do that. All right. She doesn't need anything. Uh, we're, we're gonna replace that. Then I'm gonna bring her up here to dance. Um, carnival beats. Sure. Go up here and listen to that and go dance. Uh, but yeah, if you guys ever see me on the FYP or anything like that, let me know. Because I would definitely, definitely love to hear that. Um, and Nace, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the cabana. Grab a drink, grab a lunch, share, and get comfy. The jump scare one did. Yeah. The, w the one that Sam did to me. And cackled the entire time. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah. The ones that show you guys how much of a troll my mods are. Alright, how much food is left? Oh, okay. So she needs to eat that. And then I think we're gonna make some asado. We haven't made some in a while. So make some asado once you're done eating. And I think she needs to shower. Ooh, does this mean we can make some money now? Okay. Hi, Dag. How are you, my love? Okay, why is Eeyore coming back? He didn't just, like, romantically sigh over his mother, did he? I'm sorry, that's weird. Please don't. Please never do that again, Sims. 
That that's a that's a hard pass. Hard pass. All right, nothing's broken over here. Oh, baby's crying. Go take care of the baby first. You've McFallen? I'm sorry. Hi, bud. I know. Go on. It's okay. Go have fun. Oh, I have a lot of dishes here. I did not realize that. All right, 60, 60 simoleons a pop. And uh, Remy Jean, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the cabana. Grab a drink, grab a lunch, share, and get comfy. A meeting time? Sounds good, fearsome. Good luck. Hopefully it doesn't bore you to tears. Although, let's be real, most meetings do that. Yeah, most meetings do do that. Um... And also, too, for those, I know some people don't have a TikTok. Uh, also, too, um, the TikToks are going on YouTube as well. So, if you have not followed either account, there's the links for it. Uh, you're the one speaking, so yeah, probably boring. I doubt that. I doubt that. Also, too, guys, we are three subscribers away from 250, 250 on YouTube. So, I would love to meet that today. And Forever Strange, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the cabana. Grab a drink, grab a lunch, share, and get comfy. Did she go out there and start painting all on her own? I mean, I'm proud, but like, um... You have until the toddlers wake up. You're thinking about a family member. Alright, that's cute. Oh, wait. It's 2.30 in the morning. Both of you are probably really tired. Uh, 12.30. Go to sleep, both of you. No, go to sleep. Mom is going to cook. I don't trust anybody but us to use the grill. Because last time that you lit it on fire. Please don't do that. I was? Nice. Nice. I love that. Um, So was it the jump scare, Sin Twin? Because, yeah, the, the, jump, the jump scare... Yeah, that, that, that one was not fun. Oh, did you finish? Excellent. Nice. We're gonna make some money off that. Alright, make some really quick. Make some asado so they stop trying to make food. Yeah, that'd be great. Uh, clean that, then shower. And we should be good. And then from there, I'm gonna have you come here and research stuff. Uh, research gardening. We might buy some gardening books for her, too. We might. So, all right. No. Oh. Oh. Oh, yeah. Go, go potty, please. Yeah, definitely, definitely go potty. Please, please don't, because then I have to give you a bath. And we all know that's probably not going to happen. I'm just being realistic. Yeah, my toddlers don't get baths. <laughs> Hardly at all. Sometimes they do. At least in this house, I added a bathtub, though, guys. Yeah, at least in this one, I added a bathtub. All right, I'm going to have you slide twice and then... Depending on how long it takes mom to do that. Oh, yeah, we can have her definitely. All right. Yeah, we're going to have mom come and teach you shapes. Just to get you aged up. Okay, which miscreant did this? <sighs> I don't know which one did that, but no. All right, shapes time. Oh, hey, he did make it. Nice. I missed the notification. All right. Um, 
No. Stop. Study shape help from mom. Come on, mom. Yeah, come do that. Are you hungry? What do you need? Not much, actually. Just clean up a little bit. Because you've already done your homework. You did... Did she... Did... They did not do projects. But I can sell that. Makes a little bit of money off you. Make a little bit of money off you. Yeah, once she eats, finishes eating, she just goes to the bathroom and hygiene. And then we'll just sit them upstairs talking to each other until... Yeah, until it's time for school. And then we'll kick one out. So that'll give us... One, two, three, four, five. Five. Oh, I don't like that. I do not like that one bit. Do not like that. Alright, are you done eating? Please finish. Thank you. I really am going to need you to uh, shower before school. Yeah, I'm really going to need you to shower. I'm sorry. Because you're really gross. Really, really, really gross. Okay, come on. Please tell me you're, in, you're almost in the shower. She's butthurt again. You didn't sit that long, though. She literally sat to eat. And she got butt hurt from sitting down to eat. I can't. I cannot. I can not. Oh, when you're done with that, go take care of the baby. Okay, bye. You are studying hard. You are going to school? Did you... You did fully shower. Alright, we should, emphasis on should, get rid of a kid today. Should. Alright, wonderful. Shapes. You don't get to go talk to anybody. Get back here. She is busy doing other toddler e thingies. Yeah. You're going to go potty train her again. Alright. Then you'll do, I think, maybe two shapes ought to do this one. Let me see. 81. Yeah, I think two shapes should do it. Um, And Slayon, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the cabana. Grab a drink, grab a lunch, share, and get comfy. Alright. Finish your potty. Oh, and she had to go anyway. Okay. And he's also very... Oh, and very hungry. Alright, grab a serving after this. We're gonna... T we're gonna push it. We're gonna push it. I wanna see. Alright, we're at 99. There we go. Go eat. Now who's calling? Uh, no. Excellent time management. No. Absolutely not. You, I'm going to max out potty. We've maxed out imagination. Let's max out potty and then we'll do movement. And then she'll just have to learn blocks. Yeah, that, that's, that'll have to work. Oh, uh, you'd like to do a rags to riches with a high maintenance sim, but you're afraid you would just give up. That would be so... Fun and irritating all at the same time. Because, like, we're trying... In the rag in our rags to riches, we're trying to do it with Keegan, who's a kleptomaniac, but you can't steal anything. Like, everything, everything I try to steal, it just says he does not own. Which doesn't make any sense. Because he's a kleptomaniac, so it should give me the little steal thingy option for him to attempt to steal. I'm like, how else is he going to get his mischief up? He can't try to steal anything. Yeah. 
Oh, he's gonna pass out. Tot down, tot down. Yeah, come here and eat your asado. Sorry about your luck, kiddo. You're not done yet. 74. I think you're gonna need... 82, 91. Yeah, you're gonna need three in total. It took the toddler that long to pass out. All right. All right. Sure, why not? Why not? All right, can you like finish up so we can age you up, please? Please? Who's here? Eeyore again. No Eeyore. Thank you. Bye bye. Um, what can you see with the kleptomaniac? Also depends on level of mischief. Wait, really? Fine. I guess that's what I'm gonna have to do in the next one. Get his mischief up so he can start stealing stuff. Like the kid can't even swipe someone else's food in front of them at a cafe so he can eat himself like that's how bad of a kleptomaniac the kid is every time he tries he goes up to it the person looks at him and then he backs away and i'm just like keegan we didn't torture you to find your limits in the name of science for you to to wimp out on me now All right, let's age the tot up. Candles help from mom. I'm pretty sure he does. I'm pretty sure he does. All right, what are you at? 94. I'm going to throw another one on there just to be safe. You want to do a would you rather? All right, we can do that as soon as the toddler ages up. It's because I want the tot aged up and gone all right but i will get it ready all right um can you put birthday candles on please okay thanks age up that was a delay whatever it's fine it's fine all right so he is competitive all right where's my randomizer all right randomizer this is gonna be out of four two a whiz kid who is competitive all right i don't hate it do we like it if we like it we will lock it in in five four Three, two, one, zero. All right, lock it in. All right, what is, what is this? Combating a cold from a home remedy. All right, and she reached potty level three. Great, so now she can potty on her own. That's a lot of gifts. Nice. Nice. All right, let's take a look at the kid. Who is depressed? Honestly, I don't blame the kid. But I don't hate the look. I don't hate the look. All right, then. Oh, you are very tired. I was going to say. All right, we're going to assign this bed to you. And then I'm going to send you up to go sleep. Oh, yeah, I'm going to sign the bed to you and then I'm going to have you nap. Then bathroom and then we'll figure it out from there. All right. So would you rather for this one? How we do this is I pose a would you rather question and then um, you guys tell me um, the mod for the mods. We can also do it as a poll. Um, 
So, would you rather... Uh, let's see. We already did that one. Uh, okay, here we go. I like this one. Um, and Brianna Collins, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the cabana. Grab a drink, grab a lunch, chair, and get comfy. All right. Would you rather be the last person in the world or be the best athlete in the world? So here, I'll, I'll do the poll for it. Would you rather be the last person in the world? So last person in world or the best athlete in the world? So, which would you rather? Would you rather be the last person or the best athlete? And tell me your reason why. Because I'm kind of curious. The introvert in you is saying last person. That is fair. That is fair. I think I would go with best athlete, personally. Yeah, I think I would go with best athlete. But, like, because I feel like even though, like, it'd be nice to have, like, alone time and such, I think I would just get too bored if I was the last person. Yeah, I feel like I would just be too bored. Yeah, yeah, I think I think that would be my answer. I definitely do, yeah. Uh, too much spotlight popularity for athlete. Don't want that attention. Yeah, but would you really want to be like no one? Uh, no new series or anime. No, thank you. Uh, oh, that is a good point. If you are the last person in the world, eventually you would watch everything, and there would be nothing new. I didn't get the. I didn't go that far. Y'all are like actually thinking this through. I was just like, I'd be bored, so no. Okay, see, this is why I ask you guys to tell me your reasonings, because like apparently I don't think it through enough. You think you would freak out if you were the last person? That is fair. That is fair. But like, I can see the appeal of it. I can definitely see the appeal of it. Yeah. And definitely see the appeal. All right. Sorry, I was asking for a Kleenex because I don't have mine up here. All right. Okay. So most of you, oh, it's almost 50-50. Almost 50-50, okay. Okay. I like it. I like it. You back gotta take kid to dentist? Oof. Oof. Good luck, Sam. Good luck. Um, oh, Sam. Does your dentist have a toy box? If your dentist does not have a toy box... Try to get your dentist to, to create one. Because there's apparently a dentist that's making a toy box for adults. Um, my dentist has a toy box for the kids. I was allowed to get into it until I got my first cavity in my 20s. So, highly recommend. Because, yeah. Only the, only the well-behaved ones did. Only well-behaved ones were able to get in the toy box. So, it was an incentive to not bite the dentist. Especially when he says, so even still, he should still have, that's even more reason to have toys and goodies and such. I got bouncy balls, which actually. I have, I have a lot of the bouncy balls. 
These are from when I was like teenager up. These aren't from when I was a kid. Cause like, yeah, very few people actually keep stuff that long. Granted, I do have a Doom box, so there's probably some in the Doom box, but. All right, let's see. Okay, thank you, thank you, both of them. All right, Tiffany, I don't care if you're sad. Blow your candles out, I'm kicking you out. In the meantime, I need this. I'm going to give this to you. And I'm going to sell everything. Oh, man. All right, that works. Okay, blow your candles out. But yes, the toy box at the dentist was what made going to the dentist fun. Well, one of the things. But I actually like my dentist, so... All right, she is high maintenance, who gets butt hurt a lot. Uh, then she's also competitive. Let's see what else. A geek. I mean, I guess I could see it. I guess I can. Hmm. All right, what do we think? Do we like it or do we not like it? If we like it, I can go ahead and lock it in, in five, four, three, two, one, zero. All right, we will lock it in. Hi, Moo, how are you? How is your day going? Add birthday candles. All right, I'm sad we're not gonna get that many, but you know what, it's okay. All right, get out my house. Get out of my house. Goodbye. Thank you. Wait, how is she running on the treadmill when she's pregnant, but it won't let me do that? That makes no sense. Are oh, you working from home for two days? Nice, nice. Nice. Um, hang on. We're gonna have you play arithmetic attack. Are you done? Yeah, wake up and go go to the bathroom before you like pass out and die. Wait a minute. Oh, there is a roof over top. Okay. Looks like that's weird. Alright. All right, go do that. He's still mad about needing to use a porta pot, a, not porta potty, a toddler potty. But all right. Oh, I guess she can. Oh wait. <coughs> Yay, fearsome! You're back just in time too. So uh, Cole has decided to ask us out on a date now. Do we? Since he was, do we go on a date with him now? Considering we just went on a date with him not too long ago. Because this is the set we start dating him. Like, actually dating him. Even though he did ask if he could go on a date with someone else. I think we know Frost Dance. All right, all right, we'll go on the date. We'll go on the date. He was just trying to get her jelly. All right, all right. I mean, I guess he just want. I guess he was testing the waters to see how we'd respond. I don't know. All right. All right. I don't know if I recognize this. But okay, request a table. Did she seriously just like go around the corner to go in? All right. 
And he did the same thing. So I wonder if there's like something blocking that there. All right. Wait to be seated. Wait, you mean I have to pay? I mean, I have the money, but dang. Dang. Maybe he was a little lonely. That is fair. That is fair. That is definitely fair. Definitely, definitely fair. All right. Oh, they required the thinking skill. Great. Well. Flirt with him and let's see. Let us see. Oh, we probably should order for the table. Yeah, we probably should order for the table. What should we get, guys? What should we get? We can get one dish and one drink. I'm thinking for her, since she's pregnant, she needs to go with, like, the apple juice. Yeah, I'm thinking for her, go with the apple juice, just because she is pregnant. And we think water for him. All right. Appetize. Should we go with an appetizer? Or should we go with the with the main course? She's not really that hungry. But something she wouldn't cook for herself at home. Maybe, oh, you know what? We're going to have them both get tiramisu. That's what we're going to do. We're going to have them both get a tiramisu. Yeah. Yeah, that, that's what we'll do. Hi, Wyatt. All right, where's our waiter? Are you my waiter? You are not the waiter. There's no chef. Oh, wait. Nope, here's the waiter. Aww. That's so cute. You know what? We're just going to go for it. We're going to ask a risque question. We're just going to go for it. I mean, they've already woohooed once. They have a kid together. They may as well. Oh! Okay. I was not expecting handcuffs to come into that. All right, then. All right, then. She really went... Okay. Uh, this was a restaurant I downloaded from the gallery. Um, let's see. What's this one called? This one is... I think this was... In, this is an EA build. This was one that just appeared in your library. So, yeah. This has just appeared in your library. I don't know what it's called, though. But if you go... If you have Dine Out, go in your library and look for a, a Maxis build. And this is one of them. I didn't build it. I'm not. I'm just saying I was not expecting her to go straight for that. I know you're tired. Hold on. I'm going to buy her a, a moodlet solver. No, not a moodlet solver. A sleep one. Where's the sleep one? Sleep. All right, you're going to drink the sleep one. Drink it. 
good, uh, Shimmy Baye. Dabo, chef. <laughs> All right. I need her to drink that and put it away. Get out of my line. All right. I think I got the screenshot of that. I hope I did. Okay. It didn't take. Rude. Oh, no. Not a last exception. Where's my food? Bring my food out. She's going to have to pee. Our date's going to be over before we're done. I mean, at least they're sitting enjoying themselves. Um, your sim had a child with Victor, Victor Fang. Really? Way to walk through our, our table. Please move. All right, I'm going to do a manual screenshot for this. The waitress hates her job. Yes, 100% this waitress hates her job. 100%. All right, since I don't know why my screenshots aren't working, I'm going to do it the manual way. All right, there we go. She matches the decor at the restaurant. She does. I Yeah, she does. Oh, wait, here's our food. Here's our food. All right. Hang on. I'm trying to get the best. Oh, no. I want the booth. All right. There we go. This is better. All right. I'll have to figure out why it's not doing screenshots. Close that. Give me my screenshot. Because they're too cute. All right. Yeah. Are you going to actually eat your food? Are you, You're still on the date, though. He hasn't left. So I'm going to go with... Maybe this is going to work. Uh, yeah, it wouldn't be Sims without glitches. Honestly, Dar it, honestly, Empress, it would not be. It would not be. And thank you, Northern Simmer. Did he just take the, the drink and run? He took the drink, ran, and threw up. Um. Honestly, I don't know. Is he going to come sit back down? Eat your tiramisu. Um, let's see. He's too far away. All right, that's fine. Is he going to come sit back down with us or... So can I just put that in my inventory? Pack into sack lunch. That's what we'll do. Because I don't think he's going to eat it. And I am not wasting that. All right. Put that in your inventory. Um, End meal and pay the bill. Oh, nope. Now he's coming back. He's not doing well at all. He looks so sick. And she's and she's sick. All right, you know what? We're just going to send him home. I don't know what went wrong, but everything went wrong there. Joan is fine. He's a vampire, yes. His cake disappeared. It went into our inventory. 
Um, I put it in a sack lunch and brought it home with us. Because I feel like she deserves a treat. So, yeah. Like, I mean, okay. It's, it's fine. It's fine. Uh, what does Steam have to do with the cake like tiramisu? I have no idea. Yeah, the game is just so bugged at this point. Dine Out is super bugged. Um, but it's actually more bugged on the um, dining side than it is on the on the owning side. So, and hi, Siren Song, and hi, Emberlyn. How are you guys? I mean, of course we're going to snatch the cake. He's not eating it, and we're paying for it, so we're not going to let it go to waste. She's going to have herself a nice bit of cake when she gets home. So, immediately, we're going to put the cake in here, unpack it. Wait. Unpack the sack lunch. All right, put it in the fridge. If one of our kids eats it, I'm going to be upset. Oh, wait. All right. Okay, I put it up. Everyone, you guys can tell Kenzie I actually put it up. All right, there we go. There we go. All right, do that and go to sleep. Wait, you don't need to sleep. That's right. I gave you the moodlet solver that didn't actually help. It's fine. It's fine. Do I use mod CC? Yes. So I use MC Command Center. Um, UI cheats. Um, I have Kato CC traits. Um, I also have a CC cast background, CC um, loading screen. Um, I use Miss Lo uh, Lollipop Gaming's reshade, and um, I'll also use Twisted Mexies. I have Build By and Tool right now. So yes, I I do use some. Um, I'm not using that many mods in this one uh, because I want to play it as vanilla as possible. So that way I make sure that it's possible to do what I want it to do. Um, but yeah, when, when we do the next run, we're going to like CC it up big time. It's going to be full of CC. Yeah, it's going to be, there's going to be so much CC. <laughs> it's going to be fun though. It's definitely going to be fun. All right. Are you guys done? No, you're not yet. All right, that's fine. That is fine. Okay, did you, you did your homework, correct? No. Go do your homework and give your apple to Layla. Who is going potty on her own? Oh, I'm so proud. I am so proud. Alright, when you are done pottying, go babble to Big Puds. Alright. Um, what is CC? So, CC is custom content. Um, basically, you'll download it from the most common places are Sims Resource and Tumblr. Um, and it's basically people have create modders have created things that you can put in your game to either meet a specific need that the game is lacking or, um, because they want something in particular. Like you can get just about almost any kind of CC. I hate that I'm having to buy you more medicine. Take the medicine and go nap or something, please. Take the medicine and go lay down. Thank you. Uh, slice of life. I do not have slice of life. Um, we may add that in the next one. Um, but slice of life always breaks on me. I've never been able to like successfully play a storyline with slice of life. I don't know. Maybe I just, I'm not downloading the right stuff, but yeah, it just doesn't ever work for me. Yeah. V I only do VIP for Sims resource. Yes. Yes, I do not do, I do not use Sims Resource on the free side. I can't. It irritates me too much. So. All right. And he's just kneeling on the floor doing that, doing his homework. Great, great. All right, we'll make us some money.
No! Put it down. You just lo you just cost me 50 simoleons. Now put it put 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 it down. Thank you. Alright, there we go. Do I have a CC command? No, I don't. So typically CC I'll use um mostly Maxis Match, but I do use some alpha. It just depends. Um but I do have I don't know if it's is it on the socials? Let me look. It is not. Um, I do have a, hold on. I'll, we'll create a command for it later. Um, but I do have a Tumblr that I'll reblog stuff on that I really, really like. Um, so like right now I've got my reshades, um, Frost may like this. I have some Genshin stuff, Genshin CC on there. Um, yeah, I just have a couple of different things on there. The elemental legacy stuff that I use, um, the kitty slippers, the shelf that I, red shelf I use, that sort of thing. I need to go through and actually, like, up, like, add stuff to it, so. I'll add that to my many, th my long, long, long to-do list. But, and hi, Rachie, how are you? How is your day going? Hi, Kenzie, how are you feeling? Can we get all the love and chat for Kenzie, please? Oh, you need, you need to take a shower. Come here and get less stanky, kid. Oh, somebody, she never did her project. Oh, well, okay, put it in here. I forgot the project existed. That's my bad. You're almost back to 100%. Yay! Yay! I'm so glad, I'm so glad. I've been very worried about you. It's been snowing in the UK today. Oof. Don't say that. That's a four-letter word. And not the fun kind of four letters. So, all right. Mom is apparently running on, on the treadmill. And, and what trimester are you in? Second trimester. Apparently, they, she can do that now. All right. You did your homework. Yeah, you finished your homework. Let's have you go play chess. Just to get your skills up. Oh, you can eat that real quick. Eat your apple. Yeah, eat your apple. I've tried to keep the spreadsheet up, Kenzie. Emphasis on tried. Oh, wait. I haven't even opened it yet today. That's my bad. This is definitely my bad. Alright, you know what? I I tried. I should get a I should get one of those like you tried stickers. Alright, eat another apple. I mean, apart from that, I mo kind of did. Oh, I didn't know. Okay, I didn't do any traits. That's that's my bad. But I kept, I got the, the kids and the dads and, and that done. So uh, there were, an attempt was made. An attempt was made. And uh, thank you for the lurk, Darla. There, the attempt was there. Did it succeed? Uh, jury is out on that. All right. What are you, you're almost done. Cool. All right, come here. Um, babble to big puds until you're done with that. What is, mom is still, oh, mom's done working out. Oh, no babble, no babble, no babble, no babble. Yeah, that's great, mom, that's great. Um, come here and flash cards. Blah. <laughs> you're totally fine, you're totally fine, Kenzie. You're totally fine. Uh, what's the baby name theme? So right now the theme is um, books. So yeah, all of ours, all of the kids right now are based upon books, as are the dads. Um, after we hit 75, no, once we get to kid number 75, that will start our next set, which will be Disney slash fairy tale slash folktale. Yes, save. Thank you. We have not saved in a while. That would be bad. 
That would be bad. So, yeah, that we, so, basically we divided it into sets of four. So, the first set is, um was tv shows second set was movies third set that we are currently in is books and then we swap over to the disney fairy tale folktale because a lot of fairy tales and folktales um are made into disney movies so you're fine fearsome do not apologize i'm gonna, hold on i'm gonna do my sorry i'm gonna, I'm gonna sorry you to death all right, fin get 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 your thinking skill up, kiddo. It's barely going up. You know what? Whatever, it's fine. Did she just she just told me no? How dare? How dare? Of all the actual audacity. A toddler telling us no. All the audacities here. All right, then teach shapes to Ly Lila. Let me guess. Rian Miyazaki. I, again, don't know you. Don't know you. Don't know why I'm being told that you are. Yeah, all right. Oh, wait, school starts in an hour for them? No, wait, hold on. Are you at level two? Or... Okay, good. You're almost to level three. Get to level three. I'll let you use the bathroom. Did not realize it was almost time for school. My bad. She knows what she wants early in life. Fair. You have to go into the office on Wednesday to meet your boss in person for the first time and you're stressing. Ooh, I'm sorry. I am so sorry. And hi, Sasha. No, so this is the same mom. She's just dressed differently. She is in her workout wear. But it's the same mom. So this is Ariana. She's just in her workout gear. And I guess, my, yeah, my toddler went to sleep. You know what? Fine, whatever. It's fine. It's fine. Wait, where's the food? Wait, when did that get struck by lightning? Rude. Oh, and the cake, the cake went bad. All right. You know what? It's fine. Uh, no, you can't go do that yet. I need you to grill some more food. Yeah, I need you to grill some more food and then you can go do that. Oh, wait. First clean that because that's disgusting. You're back-ish. Uh, but yeah, we, we have missed you, Kenzie. We have missed you. All right, she's making food. She, then she needs to sleep and such. Are we going to school? We are going to school. Okay. Study hard and study hard. Oh, did that's okay. Okay, put that to there. Um. Clean the floor here when you're done. Have her take a shower. Get some food. And then we're going to send her to sleep. And then when the t when the kids get back, they can clean the potty. So that works. Oh, you haven't been in the office to work for this job ever? And, you haven't, and you've worked there for over a year? Oh, you've been remote the whole time. Oof. Well, hopefully they let you stay remote. Okay, see, bills are back to normal now, I think. Let's check. Nope, bills aren't back to normal. Nope. At least they, they're they making us pay a normal price. Instead of the random 12K. Although, you know what? I was thinking about that. That was the first... Um, the first set of bills that we got in this house. So I'm wondering if it was making us pay the bills from the last house as well as the current house. That would make a little bit of sense. Uh, she just wants you to connect and meet with people, which is super cool. And all but in person, you're super introverted. I feel that. I feel that. 
All right. Fiona, my dear. It's wonderful you came to visit, but... We need our sleep. As soon as the toddler sleeps, I'm putting the toddler to sleep. As soon as... As soon as the toddler eats, I'm putting the toddler to sleep. Wow. Uh, you're smart going on a day. They're catering lunch. And your boss already asked you your coffee order from Starbucks. Okay, I may like this boss. As long as the boss does not take you away and make you go back to the office, I will like I will give the boss a chance. If the if the boss tries to take you away from us, I will be sad. Uh, plus your office is dog friendly. Even better. Even better. All right, go to sleep. Ugh. Clementine and Fiona have the same last name. I'm scared. Hold on. Vivek Meat. Okay, so they're married to siblings. All right. Okay. I was I I was so afraid for a moment. Guys, I I was so scared for a second. I thought we were going to have another overlapping situation. It's fine. Oh, she's... Hold up! Hold up! Hold up! The one that started the whole thing, India! Okay, hold up. So these are Indy's kids. So she... Oh, God. So Fiona's... Oh, God. This is why the family tree is so convoluted. No, I'm, I don't even know why I looked at it. I don't even know why I did. Nope. Nope, nope, nope. This family tree is a hot mess, guys. A hot mess. I'm not gonna lie. It's a little bit scary. A little bit creepy. I don't know. Kind of sus. Alright, make another cake. Because I'm pretty sure we're gonna have to age someone up today. Yeah, let's make a chocolate cake. No, you don't have time to talk to them. I was gonna say now what? Ask him to apologize. I don't. I don't care. Uh, you want to steal this boss already? I mean, this boss sounds like a decent boss, so we'll, we're giving the boss the benefit of the doubt. Uh, you're not gonna get anything done in the office. You'll be snuggling dogs and eating food from the fully stocked fridge and pantry. Yeah, I would too. I would too. Tigger, what gives? Why did you not age up? Child, what's wrong with you? Oh, we're not doing that project. Uh, no, we're not going over to anyone's house. All right, let's sell our stuff. Oh, we can't sell all of it. We can sell most of it. Hi, sweetheart. Did you have fun? All right, I'm going to say 3K. Oh, 4.8K. Nice. And that's without the, the flowers and such. Nice. All right. I mean, guys, we're si we've had eight kids in this house. And we've made 102,000 simoleons. So, I think it's safe to say we're not hurting for money. My plan of, um, oh wait, no, don't stock the table. Yeah, once you're done taking care of the baby, stock the table and do that. Ooh, wait. 
You can upgrade those? What? Yes, please. Even with how often we're having to replace stuff because it keeps getting struck by lightning. And hi, Sabine. How are you? How is your day going? My day's been going good. My day's been going good. Oh. I'm gonna put the cake... Oh, wait. No, we need to put some... We need to put, um... Candles on it real quick. Um, you stop what you're doing. Put candles on it. Why can't I put candles on it? Candles. Thank you. You have other needs, right? You do need to eat. Fine. I'll let you get some asado. Yeah, so get some asado and then I'll put you to sleep. Yeah, we'll do that. In exchange for doing that, I'll let you put your homework off to another day. Or, well, after you sleep. So whenever that happens. All right, Tigger, do your stuff. You're good with at the gym today's leg day. Oof. Yeah, I bet your legs are jelly. I bet they are. All right, you almost done with this. Why are you sad? Wait! It said losing a child. Who just died that I didn't notice? Hold up. The last one to go was... Sid, right? So... Okay, Littlefoot's still with us. Ronald is still with us. Clementine is still with us. Wait. Where's Cameron? Yeah, because that's Littlefoot. Hold on. I'm missing a child on my family tree. All right. Hiccup. We knew Hiccup passed. We knew Thanos passed. We knew Shrek and Benji did. Here's Manny. Um, and Carolina Jr., thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the cabana. Grab a drink, grab a lunch chair, and get comfy. I'm currently trying to figure out which one of my kids died. Sid. Okay, so here's Sid. Monica, Darren, Linda, Iris. Cameron did die. So why didn't, why hasn't Littlefoot died yet? Unless maybe it just happened. And Cuddly Stuff, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the cabana. Grab a drink, grab a lunch, share, and get comfy. Because they're twins. They were aged up at the same time. That's weird, guys. I don't know. I don't know. We might be getting another phone call in a moment. How many children has Neighborhood Stories killed off? I don't want to know. Littlefoot's still alive, though. That's the weird thing, Gabby. Um, you did not raise us. You No, you don't have the right to do that. Excuse you. Absolutely not. Absolutely not. You need to eat. Come here and get food. Grab a serving of food. Thank you. Yeah, because that's all she needs to do. Tigger just needs to eat and I guess do the rest of the homework? Sure, why not? So weird though. 
It's like really super weird. Really, really, really super weird. Oh, wait a minute. I just realized. The farmer cool looks so weird. Hold on. Why did no one tell me I never updated the follow one? I thought I did. I must have, like, reverted it or something. I don't know. Oh, no! Prim has aged up, guys! Prim has aged up! Red alert! Red alert! Red alert! Prim has aged up! Alright, are we ready? Are we ready? Kinsey has returned to us, so maybe that means that the juju is now gone. All right. Okay, Charmer. All right. So if we like Charmer, I will lock it in in five. Nope, Duck Duck. Wild. And then Wyatt. Wild again. All right. I will lock it in in five, four, three. Pause. <laughs> uh, uh, we'll do your reroll after the raids come in, uh, Sabine. Thank you for that. Welcome in, guys. Welcome in. How are we? How was stream? What did we get up to today? Tell me all the things, all the things. Welcome in, Rachel. Can we get shout outs for Rachel, please? But how are we? How is everybody? How is everyone? Are we having a good day? We are trying to find out what type of child I'm going to have. Yeah. Uh, you just got to the air gen. Nice, nice. What do you think? What do you think? I'm curious to know your thoughts. I'm curious to know your thoughts. Um, so yeah, so, um, we actually, you guys are just in time, and also nobody told me I didn't update my follower goal, so, my bad. Um, it's updated now, but we've had two re-rolls so far, and we're about to do another one. So we went from wild to... Son of a biscuit! Y'all! All right, do we like this? If so, I will lock it in in five, four, three, two, one. Thank you, Kay Vogel. Coming in with a save. Charmer. All right, we got, you're allowed one more reroll. But if so, I will lock it in in five, four, three, two, one, zero. Frost coming in with the last one. All right. And it stayed Charmer. All right. Well, I guess that was the plan to have her be a Charmer. Sure. I actually don't like Charmer kids. I think they're a pain in the butt. But, um, but yeah, so, um, Rachel, the, um, we're currently on the air gen. We were going to do air gen today, um, but we've had so many issues with, um, internet the past week that I wanted to just do 100 Baby. I was like, you know what? 100 Baby, I, I, don't I I don't have to think that hard about Hunter Baby, whereas um with the Elemental Legacy you have to continually plan ahead. And that's really with any legacy challenge. You just have to continually plan ahead. And I was like, my brain hurts, I don't want to do that. So we're doing Hunter Baby. And I know some people are like, wait, you don't have to plan ahead for Hunter Baby? No, because I know what I'm doing. And it's all just yeah. It's second nature to me now. So but yeah, I'm glad you're enjoying it. I'm glad you're enjoying it. So, um, I will tell you right now, the insects are very hard. The insects are very hard. We are struggling on that. We, we are missing, I think, four insects. Yeah, it is. It's oddly calming. It is. It's a fun challenge. I'm glad. I'm glad. Um, we tried to make it fun for you. At 30 plus babies, you're good to go usually. Yeah, that is true, Amy. That is very true. Uh, once you get to a certain point, however, in this version of it, um, I make it harder on myself because um, every 25 kids, we move and reset the money to zero. So um, how do you catch insects? You um, will 
you have to go to Granite Falls in order to catch the insects. So, all right. Apparently, y'all want to do some extra fun stuff really quick for the raiders. That is perfectly fine. Um, let me start the bingo while we do the other one. So you wanted food. You guys and your food bingos. All right. All right. And then we'll just pop over to the um, community one so you guys can grab your bingos while we do the uh, Would You Rather and Never Have I Evers. So basically for the Raiders coming in, we do have these um, kind of sub games that we play. Um, one is Would You Rather where I ask you a question on you tell me which one of the two you would rather do. Um, we also have bingo, which they just redeemed. So if you'd like to grab bingo, all you have to do is hover over the screen um, and over to the side this way. It'll have a thing that pops up. This is live bingo. Everybody gets one free bingo card. If you'd like additional ones, they are 200 biddies a piece. Uh, you can get up to six bingo cards. Um, you have to save up and get more packs where you can do the legacy challenge. Yes, the good part about the elemental, though, is that if you don't have a pack, you could technically skip that generation, and it won't hurt you negatively. As far as, like, in the overall challenge. And then we also have Never Have I Ever to where I'll give you a list of ten things, and then you tell me how many you've done. There's a pretzel on the card. Nice, nice. And Rachel, were you, were you lurking? Did you know that I have pretzels? So, all right. You'll be grudgingly grab your bingo card. I feel that. All right. Some of these are gross. I don't know if I like these. Yeah, I don't know if I like these questions. We're going to do a new one. We're, I'm going to look for new ones. I'm going to look for a new generator because I don't like those. Yeah, those are... Um. Okay, this is a good one. This is a good one. Would you rather always have spinach stuck in your teeth or always have dandruff on your shoulders. Yes, you guys can all have pretzels. Mm -hmm. Is this shawarma on your on your bingo card? Is there shawarma? I don't know if there is shawarma on it or not. That'd be interesting to find out. Um, but yeah, would you rather have spinach stuck in your teeth? Always have spinach stuck in your teeth or always have dandruff on your shoulders? Okay, overwhelmingly, you guys are saying dandruff, but there are some saying spinach. Okay. I would rather have dandruff on my shoulders because I do anyway. <laughs> but, like, everybody has dandruff on your shoulders to a certain degree. Uh, dandruff is, like, basically... It's basically, like, the, the skin cells on your scalp that are shed. That you can actually see. It's It sounds gross. But like. It's just. It's no different than. Like you having hair. Stuck on your on your shirt. Uh, Dan if you have long hair. So you can cover it. Smart. Smart. I think a lot of people would have long hair. If that was the case. Um, it's yeah. It's usually not as noticeable. Um, and I've noticed people don't call attention to it as much as the spinach one but it doesn't say what tooth it's stuck in it could be stuck in the back of your like on the in the molars for all you know we just assume it's going to be front teeth so but yeah okay okay but yeah overwhelmingly you guys want you guys per, would prefer dandruff yeah i'd have to agree with you i would have to agree with you All right, let's do another one. Oh, hold on. Okay, here's a, here's a here's a good one. Here's some here's some good ones. So, I'm going to read you a list of 10 things and then you guys will tell me at the end how many you have done. So, never have I ever been to a Comic-Con. Never have I ever created a YouTube video. 
Never have I ever snuck into a concert. Never have I ever been to a professional hockey game. Never have I ever snuck candy into a movie theater. Never have I ever gotten a subscription to Netflix. Never have I ever been to Las Vegas. Never have I ever listened to country music. Never have I ever been to a concert. This is not counting the one you snuck into. And never have I ever participated into a school play. So just to recap, uh, been to Comic-Con, created a YouTube video, snuck into a concert, been to a professional hockey game, snuck candy into a movie theater, had a subscription to Netflix, been to Las Vegas, listened to country music, been to a concert without sneaking in, or participated in a school play. All of them fearsome? All right, 10, 10. All right, all right. Sentient three, okay. Okay, Vogel five, Amy five. All right, you've done all of them. I mean, these are ones that a lot of us have done. I'm not gonna lie. Hang on, how many have I done? Let me tell you how many I've done. One, two, three. I've only done six. I've only done six. Yes, Sharon, it does. That that would that would count. Yes, that would count because I know a lot of people are on a family plan. So, uh, because let's be real, who doesn't share their Netflix password? Hi, Liam. Been to Comic Con, created a YouTube video, snuck into a concert, been to a professional hockey game, snuck candy into a movie theater, subscribed to Netflix, uh, been to Las Vegas, listened to country music, been to a concert without sneaking in, or participated in a school play. So, all right. All right. So, it looks like, let me see, Adelina, you've only done two. Which two have you done? Have you done? Although first, fess up, fess up. How many of y'all have stuck candy into a movie theater? Fess up. How many of y'all have snuck candy into a movie theater? <laughs> so basically everybody. You've stuck an entire burrito meal into the movie theater? Kenzie. Kenzie, I gotta applaud that. I love boxes of candy cost like 12 bucks for a small thing that you eat before the previews are even over and then you just sit there disappointed the entire movie because you don't have anything. Concession food is expensive. Yes. Your mom got a bucket of chicken in. Wow. You stuck a meatball sub and Starbucks coffee into Alice in Wonderland? Okay, Daenerys, I have to give you props for that one. That's that's amazing. This is genius. I, you might be, Faye. You might be. But, like, okay, let's be real. Nowadays, you go to the movies and you spend, like, 30 bucks for one person. Never imagine if you have kids that go with you, you probably drop a good hundred dollars, if not more. Like, do y'all remember when the dollar movie theaters were still active to where you could go for a dollar? Like, that was, that was the golden age of going to movies. I think... Uh, it wasn't until about like 10 years ago that the dollar movie theater in my area finally closed down. Maybe it was more than that. It feels 10, 10 ish years, give or take a couple, but drive-ins. Yes. Yes. And hi, Rosmo. How are you? Uh, you remember going to the movie theater for two, for two euro on your first date. That's so cute. That is so cute. I love that. I love that. All right. But Adelina has won this one with having done the least amount. So I, I, I find, okay. You get 5,000 popcorn for that. Congrats. 
Congrats. All the cheap movie theaters, yeah, they, they did end up closing. We, yeah. It's very sad. Uh, most movie theaters went under. And hi, Owl Lover Girl, how are you? Yeah, now you pay so much for just the ticket. Let, never mind that you wanted something to snack on or something to drink. Although I do know somebody who pretended to be eight months pregnant and pulled it off because they had some sort of like, it was sort of like some sort of like thing to where like you could simulate like the look of a pregnant uh, stomach went like for a clothing mannequin um, to, it was for like maternity clothes. She took it off the mannequin and like somehow strapped it to her and hid stuff inside the cavity. I was like, that's dedication. I would never do that, but that's dedication. I remember going to see the live action Pinocchio with Jonathan Taylor Thomas at the Dollar Theater. I forgot there was a live action Pinocchio. I forgot there was one. I honestly, though, I, I hated the movie Pinocchio. I thought it was the, what a terrible movie. So, uh, when... Is there? Yeah, I guess there is one. I guess there is one. Um, and CS Minim, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the cabana. Grab a drink, grab a lunch, share, and get comfy. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I forgot they redid that one. But, like, not surprised. Zero su surprise there. Oh, you pay for the AMC Movie Pass. Do you actually use that, though, Fearsome? That's the question, is do you actually use it? I'm doing good. I'm doing good. All right, let's do some bingo really quick. So, O slash if you have your bingo and you're ready to go. As long as you see two movies, it pays for itself. Oh, okay, that's, that's fair, then. That's definitely fair. All right, let's go ahead and get started. Who is going to be the chosen one today? k Don, you are the chosen one. Good luck. Good luck, good luck, good luck. All right. Dim sum. Macaroon. Oh, wait, someone asked about shawarma. What does shawarma look like? I don't even know what it is. I don't see anything shawarma related. So I'm going to say probably not. Yeah, probably not. Oh, the brown funnel. That's kebabs. It does not look like kebabs, though. All right. The last one was cheese. Yummy, yummy cheese. Salt. Pancakes. We're aiming for a pretzel here. Frappes, which looks more like an iced coffee, but whatever. Hey, there it is. There's the pretzel. Pineapple. Now we want a coconut. Come on, give me coconut. Mushrooms. We had a plum. Coffee. Shawarma is a type of kebab. Oh, okay. Broccoli. Which I actually really like broccoli. And hi, Fleur. How are you? How is your day going? And avocado. Thanks. I'm a potato. Eggplant. There's no funny thing for that. It's just eggplant. Wine. Pomegranate. Well, dang. Blue-eyed butterflies. Dang. That was a fast one. Nana got a fast one. All right. All right. All right. The red onion. It's the second time y'all have said this. I know what you're saying it looks like. But I'm going to disagree for the sake of not going there. All right, if you were one away from a bingo, put a rude in chat. Yep, if you were one away from a bingo, put rude in chat. 
All right, so it looks like we have two winners. You didn't even get five marks on your card? Oh no, I'm so sorry. All right, so we're gonna declare all of them winners. So Nana and Blue-Eyed Butterflies both get points. And then we've got Nana. All right, so there you go. There you uh, go. Okay, we'll go ahead and end that one. Thank you guys for that. Thank you for redeeming these. I'm so sorry, Fearsome. I'm so sorry. You will get it one of these days. I promise you, you will get it. You will definitely get it one of these days. So, all right. We can pop back over into some simmies. All right, but let's see. Okay, I think we're good. Uh, you've only won once in over... Se we haven't done it for seven months. We've only done it since December, Fearsome. We've only been doing bingo since then. What's your overall? What is your overall? Okay, I see what you mean. I see what you mean. But you still have nine points overall. Oh, you're including marbles. Oh, yeah, okay. Marbles is marbles is very Yeah. Mar marbles is very hit or miss, for sure. For sure. All right. Okie doke. So, really quick, for any of the raiders that came on through, um, if any of you do need to run off and go do other stuff, Rachel, if you need to go run, take care of yourself, do self-care stuff, anything like that, please feel free to do so. Thank you for trusting me with your community. I will do my best to take good care of them. So... Unfortunately, since when I reinstalled my computer, it lost all of our um, records for it. So, that was a bummer. Uh, you've won one game of bingo that you've played out of every game type? That's, I'm sorry. I am sorry. All right. You need fun. You know what? I'll let you come up here and play video games. Sure. All right, so we've got the little one who needs to... Oh, wait, mom's here. Mom can teach you basic needs. All right, go do that. You're whining because you can't... I mean, it's fair. That is fair. That is fair. All right, we just became good friends with Prim over just a, hi, how are you moment. Okay, good to know. Yes, you can like video gaming. Oh, you're a hot mess. Yep, you are a hot mess. Once you're done with that, go to sleep. Oh, you're almost caught up on Claire's not so berry challenge? Yeah, she's she blew through the not so berry, so I'm I'm very impressed with her. Very, very, very impressed. Um, how has she not had her baby yet? Because we just had one. Um, she will be shortly, which means we're going to need to vote on, on a dad. So, she had, we started stream, um, right after she had her baby. So, we ended last time with the 50-50. So, we're just waiting on her to go into labor. Which, actually, I think I may wake the two kids up and have them do their homework now. You did all your homework, right? You didn't do your extra credit work. Alright, go go do all that stuff and do your extra credit work just so you're done. Yeah, go, go do all that. Nope, you don't get to do those. Sorry. Uh, do another basic needs. Okay, thanks. What do you need to age up? Actually, a lot. Alright. 
Well, that works. Okay, so... You, I know you are tired, but... What are you sad about? Miss, miss parents. No! You are not sad about that. She didn't raise you at all. She didn't do anything. She did absolutely nothing. Alright, I'm gonna have you come over here and dance. Oh, and you didn't even finish your skill. Yeah, go go do your homework. Not go not homework. Go do your your um skill builder. Okay. Did you get to level two? How close are you to level two? Kind of. Let's see. Can I get you up to level two again? One more try. Yes, the um the computer is smoking. It's okay. It'll be fine. As long as no one tries to fix it but us, it'll be fine. All right, go go teach the child. What do you need? You need communication and everything else. Yeah, you need communication. So babble away, babble, babble, babble. No, ignore mother. Thank you. And of course, the music stuff. I always forget that this happens until like it it happens. There you go. She should be going into labor at any time. Um, and Crazy Cat Lady, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the cabana. Grab a drink, grab a lunch, chair, and get comfy. Fingers crossed she does soon. Um, and Jim and McKay, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the cabana. Grab a drink, grab a lunch, chair, and get comfy. All right. Come on, kiddo. You can do it. You can do it. You need a bath desperately. I realize this. It's okay. Are you learning at all? You are not. Stack out. Wait, where did mom go? No, come here and teach shapes to Prim. Well, yeah, you're done with that. Okay. Movement. If I can get your movement done before she goes into labor. Oh, wait, no, it's going to be a bit of a delay. That's right. Because we forgot that she had to get pregnant. That's right. Uh, what pack does the tent thing come from? This came from Dream Home Decorator. And it is the most useful thing you'll ever have for the toddlers. Absolutely the number one most useful. Because it gets imagination up twice as fast. And it also gets their sleep up twice as fast. So it's very handy. Very, very, very handy. All right. You are getting your thinking up like a good toddler does. All right. And there she goes. She went into labor. We just need to get their needs up. Okay. They're to level two. Not needs. We need to get their skills up. Perfect. 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 They are at level two now. You did your homework. You are working on your skill. I think I can have you do that afterwards. So. Soon as mom is done teaching the toddler shapes, we're going to go to the hospital. Almost. 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 Perfect. I know. You are very tired. You are very tired. I realize this. So, have baby at hospital. Woo! It's time, guys. It's time. Let me get the prediction going. Is this going to be a boy or a girl? Go ahead and gamble your channel points away. Um, It's a rebellious computer. Yes, it is. The sleep thing would be so useful. You hate how much they need to sleep. I know. Like, it makes sense. But it doesn't at the same time. Like, I feel like they overdid it. Yeah, I feel like they definitely overdid it. So. I mean, it is what it is. Aw, 
All right. We're going to give it a second to give you guys a chance to get your gambling in. Looking back at it. We've had it fairly even between males and females. So it really could go either way. Uh, ben Sashi, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the cabana. Grab a drink, grab a lunch, chair, and get comfy. So also, if you guys have not seen today's TikTok, there's the link to it in chat. It's to the TikTok itself, but um, because lazy. <laughs> But, yeah, the new video is of Sam jump-scaring me. And I know y'all love it when I get jump-scared, so. Mm-hmm. There you go. And, uh, Phoebe Leah, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the cabana. Grab a drink, grab a lunch, share, and get comfy. All right, you got, like, what, 10, 15 seconds to get this in? Yeah, 15 seconds to get your predictions in. I am going to send her down. Feel like the price is right. Come on down. Oh no, he's an elder. This could be very bad. And Diora, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the cabana. Grab a drink, grab a lunch, share, and get comfy. I swear if someone else else dies today while we're giving birth, I will I will just quit. He died at work and still came back. Alright. Alright. Sure, why not? Okay, it, the prediction is officially closed. It's definitely commitment. It definitely is. No food for you. Give birth, then food. Priorities. We have priorities. Alrighty, so... It is going to be a, I'm going to say boy. I was right. Yes. All right. So for the kiddos, we have, I'm going to open it up for you guys to give me names for it. Um, Keep in mind that it needs to be a character name and then the book series and it cannot be from disney harry potter divergent twilight 50 shades of gray winnie the pooh or there was one other one. Oh, just winnie the pooh all right yeah just okay yeah those are the ones so all right it is open i will get the poll ready All right, so let me give you your points back while you guys are throwing those in for the boy. All right. And then we will predict on if it's going to be twins or a single birth. All right, we got one more. One more, guys. Miss Peregrine's. Or we have Passport 2 from 80 Days. If I could type. Oh, yes. Yes. Um, are you, um, is that like, is, is it Aaron, um, Aaron Draper? Aaron Draper. Is that who you're talking about, Ember Loon? Is that who, is that who, is that who you're talking about? Yes. Okay. 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 Yeah, 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 yeah. Um. I'm just going to put her, uh, her, the author by here. All right. Go ahead and vote in the poll for who you want it to be. Um, if you, if you know the Tamara Pierce books, Aram Draper, you may know him as Numair instead. You may, yeah, you may know him as Numair instead, but. 
yes. Yes, I I love Tamara Pierce books. Absolutely love those books. You know Miss Both, yes. Um depending on which ones of her of her books you may have read. Which the new series I'm waiting until she's finished before I I, I get it for myself. But that's just me. So but yeah, go ahead and vote for which one you want. You've read them all? Yeah, so, um... How many of those? How many books... Do, how many How many are in the new... Because the new, there's a new series about him. It is the New Mare Chronicles. There's three. There's going to be three. All right. Yeah, so there's going to be three. So I have to wait till the third one's released before I do that. So. I know because with her books, I learned the hard way. Don't start reading when they're not released yet. Her books are some of the few that I can't read when like the, it's, the series is being, is coming out. Yeah, she always rumors new, like, more. So, we'll see. Honestly, like, I, anything, she, if she wrote anything about the, about, like, Tortal or all those other things, I, I would, I would read it. 100% I would read it. All right. Okay. Y'all really went for this. Oh, my goodness. All right, you guys want Enoch? All right, all right, we'll go with it. We definitely have not had a kid named that before. All right, so did you guys vote on if you think it's going to be a um, single or twins? Yes, you did. Majority of you are going for twins. The traitors, a lot of you. The lot of you. Yes, Fearsome. That's who it's, he's based off of. Numera is based off of Jeff Goldblum. Yeah. Uh, can you explain what lurking is? So lurking is basically like you have the stream up, but you're not really there because you're off doing it, other things. So it could be you're leaving a lurk because you're not going to be at the computer at all, but you left the stream up. Um, or lurking could be you have the stream up and you're just doing other stuff. It just means that you're not actively paying attention and actively in chat. Um, yeah, Fearsome, yeah, that's who he's based off of. And, yes, I wait until a series is released fully before I start it because I learned the hard way, don't you? Unless I know that, like, they're slowly releasing it, like, I know the, the, that they're going to be releasing it on time because the author is known to release on time. I don't trust that the author will meet the deadline and will push the release date back, so I wait till they're done. So then I don't feel like I'm sitting on pins and needles waiting for the next installment because some authors have started getting wise and started doing cliffhangers at the end of their books. I don't want that. I want to be able to like decide if I want to go to bed on the cliffhanger or not. Like, yeah, but that's just me. All right, so Enoch, let's see. Is there going to be another one? We're going to find out in three, two... One. <laughs> yes! I'm playing Sims and listening. Yes, yes. That's another way to lurk. Yes. Uh, Tamara's Agency talking about a movie show deal at the first year. I would be so excited. I would be so excited. Yeah, I mean, the game has not been mean, so. Can I super fish him? Ah, you sent the baby home before I could do it. All right, can I ask, hang on. Can I ask you to pursue your dream job? Come on, do it. Four. 
No! I just don't want you to die while you're giving birth. While I'm giving birth. That's all I'm asking for is I don't want you to die while I'm give while we're doing that. I don't know. I'm happy with this. I'm happy with this. I know y'all aren't, but I am. All right, single birth. All right, we got one more vote we got to do, guys. One more vote. So let's cue her up to go in there and super efficient baby care the baby. While she does that, we have to vote on the next dad. Because I don't know about you guys, but I think she might need to be get pregnant soon. I think she might need to get pregnant soon. All right, so we go to the hashtag. All right, so let's see. We have... Um... Thomas from... Maze Runner. We're going to put in. Um, Wally's Alter Ego. We're going to go with. We haven't done this one in a while. We're going to go with a Basilton or Basilton. From carry on, then we'll go with, we'll go with her. We haven't added her in a while. All right. Uh, Yuki from Vampire Night. And then I think we're going to go with, yeah, we'll go with Simeon Snow. Or Simon Snow, yeah. Oh, two of them from Carry On. All right. All right. Okie doke. Go ahead and vote in the poll and tell me which dad you would like to see next. Oh, you never seen a Sims birth before? Yeah, it's definitely interesting. It is definitely interesting. Um, if you look on the other side, it's like he's, they're playing, um, it's like some sort of like drop game. It's like a video game on the, on like what the doctor is seeing. It's very odd. Very odd. But go ahead and vote in the poll and tell me who you think the next dad should be while we take care of the baby. All right. School starts in an hour for everyone. Everyone is sad. You know what? I give up. Did everybody do their homework? Oh, no. Remove from favorites. We don't need that. Do you finish your homework? Do your extra credit work. And you didn't finish your... Wait, no. Instead of doing extra credit work, come here and play chess. You're not going to age up, though. You should become an eight, a teen. You won't. Because you didn't get your skill up, but that's fine. Our toddler is a bouncing away. You need thinking, so come down and get some thinking skills. Yeah, come down and get some thinking skills. We have to wait till the, sh the kids go to school anyway. Otherwise, they won't. So, sleep. Uh, no, no sleep. Play inside and make believe. That works. Simon looks amazing. I don't know much about the character. I don't know much about those characters. So, again, we have, now that we've queued all that up, we have... Thomas from Maze Runner. If you choose him, he will close out the Maze Runner series. Um, then we have um, Where's Waldo's Alter Ego? Yodlaw or um, Oddlaw? Oh, you guys did go with Thomas. Okay. I was going to say then our options were Simon Snow. Or we had um, Yuki. Or... Basilton or Basilton, however you pronounce his name. This one. Yeah. 
All right, but you guys decided to go with Thomas, so that officially closes out uh, Maze Runner. So Maze Runner is no longer eligible for the dads. All right, go to school, kids. Yeah, go to school. In the thunderstorm, I know. It's not fun. It's okay, you'll be okay. Go to school so we can add him in. Go to school, both of you. I don't know why all of a sudden I'm getting a bunch of red-headed kids. It's kind of concerning. Kind of concerning. All right, study hard and study hard. Okay, to add the dads in. All righty. All right. So let's go add the dad in. Let's say Gilbert's still there, right? Yeah. So we got to move Gilbert out. Taking some of our money with him. We were getting so close to 600k and Gilbert had to survive. Mm-mm-mm. Nope. All right, Thomas, come on. All right, move in. All that stuff. Yes, yes, yes. All right. Oh, wait, that's right. I don't have to keep going back. I found a neat, nifty little trick. All right, let's go get pregnant. Are you starting to miss playing the Hunter Baby Challenge? I, I will do a disclaimer. I've done this challenge often enough that I know like most of the tricks for it. So I am going to make it look a lot easier than if you're not used to it. Um, because I, I take a lot of shortcuts. So if, if you're trying and it gets frustrating and you're like, why doesn't it isn't as simple? I just know it's because I, I do a lot of shortcuts. So, yeah, it just it comes with from having done it so often. And it has nothing to do with your with your ability to play the game. You completed it once. I mean, it's a it's a great challenge. It is definitely a great challenge. All right, Cole, I'm going to need you to get out. And, like, actually leave this time, please. All right, come here, and we're going to enchantingly introduce ourselves. For once, you're not trying to make food. All right, water shut off day. No, I need the toilet. Where are you going? Come back here. Enchanting introduction. You are not. No, get back here. Why are you trying to go outside in a storm? Really? Why are we sitting outside? Look deeply in the eyes, snuggle. What can <laughs> I'm trying to queue up stuff? Um, and Lottie, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the cabana. Grab a drink, grab a lunch, share, and get comfy. All right, hold hands, kiss neck, sweet talk him. Can I? Ah, <laughs> first kiss. All right. Yeah. No, I didn't want that. Can we, can we baby it? <gasps> I can't baby. <laughs> we can baby. Come on. It's a baby time. Come on, Thomas. You can do it. You can do it. I have faith in you. 
I was gonna say, if you try to go for food, I will just yeet you into the bedroom. But all right, we're good. Uh, that was a normal one. Maybe you should try doing this version. Uh, so basically, you just keep her pregnant. She still technically has how many days left before she ages up? She technically has eight days before she ages up to an adult, mind you. So she's had 58 kids and she's still a young adult. So, yeah, it's possible you just got to really work at it and like really pay attention to timing and stuff like that. Oh, you took Spencer that she made as a dad and you're trying to play through where he actually gets to be with Maeve? I, so, okay, k Don, I am in um, season two of Criminal Minds, so I'm getting there. I see why everybody loves it. I, I adore the team. The team is fantastic. All right, Preggy Test. Who is calling me? Peter and I are pregnant. Uh, okay. Wait! She said Peter, and now I just had a gut, gut. No. Wait, who was the one that called? Oh, God. I'm, like, terrified now. She said, Peter, please don't, please don't, please don't. I'm, I'm begging. Please, please say, please say it isn't. Um, I don't remember who called. It wasn't Fiona's married to Vivek. Oh my God, she is. No. No. If I had known that, I would have said, don't do it. Oh, God, no. No. This is why you don't keep the dads alive. Oh my gosh, why, 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 why? Bonnie, I thought you had more better standards than that. Wait, who is Bon who is Bonnie's dad? Now I now I Oh, Bonnie said was Prince Charming. All right. Peter Parker was Willy Wonka's dad, which was one, two, three, four, seven kids later. One of those, uh, two of those were twins. This is, yes, Rachel, exactly. This is why, this is why we murder and this is why we have the 50-50. The uh, for those that are confused, our daughter Bonnie is married to Peter Parker, who is Willy Wonka's dad. Oh, wait, she already had a kid? She already had a kid with someone else. Colton Munch, who's this? Who's Simone, who's married to... Interesting. Roxanne, okay. And just... But if you look at Peter Parker, he's got a get to her. This is this this is why we're not we can't have nice things. And we are pregnant. But this kind of took a damper on everything else. Alright, well. Family trees, a circle at this point. All right, what's his reaction? Oh, he's excited. All right. Well. All right. But this means, guys... This means that it is time 
for the 50-50. All right, what do we think is going to happen? Oh, I didn't put it down enough. There you go. All right, what do we think is going to happen? Do you think he is going to live or do you think he is going to Vlad? How do I feel about Gideon? I like him. He's not one of my favorites. Spencer is my favorite. But I, I like him. Uh, This tree is like a highway. Oh, God. That is very true, Rachel. It, it is very, very true. All right. You've got about 45 seconds left to get your prediction in. On if he lives or if he goes to Vlad. All right. Oh. Oh, um, I was not expecting this. I was most definitely not expecting this. I was definitely expecting him to go to Vlad. But, I mean, the coin flip doesn't lie. So, I mean, he gets to stay. You wonder what kid he'll marry. Facts. Honestly, at this point, it's only a matter of time. It's only a matter of time. What the heck? Of all, of all the ones, um... This is the second one in a row to go to um, survive the 50-50. So, all right then. Okay, well. He survived, so that means that he gets to live another day. And he is very happy about that. <laughs> yeah, be happy. Live with my nest egg. Or part of my nest egg. Mm -mm. I mean, that's just rude. That's just rude. All righty, well. I thought for sure he would go. All right, I was wrong. I'll admit it, I was wrong. All right. Well. We would have had to wait to execute the 50-50 anyway until after the kids got home from school because we're trying to yeet one, but it works. It works. All right, who are you? Manny! With those, you kind of do kind of look like the character you're based off of. 
All right, get the mail. Go back, go inside then. Because we have a kid about to come home. Maybe. How are you sleep wise? Oh, you guys are perfect. Yeah, 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 yeah. So don't sit. Don't sit. Um, come here and teach shapes to Layla. Let's try to get her aged up. Yes. At least with the legacy, you have time to keep an eye on all the kids in Miriam as you want. That is fair. That is fair. We never do, but there is that option. Where are you going? Why are you going upstairs? Go back downstairs. Are you making the kid come to you? You know what? I'm just going to replace this because I don't, I don't care. No, where's the, where is she? She's down here, right? Oh, she is right there. You made the toddler come upstairs to you. That's, that's messed up. That is messed up. All right, you should be aging up. Yes, so we'll have a teenager. Yeah, you weren't close enough, so that's fine. All right. Thank you, Tiffany. Let yeah, so let's learn let's learn our shapes while Prim can do everything else. Uh give best shot, sure. So, make believe, play inside and then go babble. That works. That works. All right. Come on, Layla. Come on. Come on, you can do it. You can do it. Imagine so too great. That's not the one I'm worried about. Come on. Thinking level two. Yes. The goal is to get her aged up within like the next little bit. Uh, no, I don't want to go to anyone's house. I am trying to teach... Sure, you can invite someone over. That's fine. Teach shapes again to Layla. All right. Tigger is an A student. Congrats to Tigger. That means, Tigger, you get to blow your candles out on your birthday cake. Blow your candles out. It's your birthday. Finally. Who are you again? Casil Kim Lewis. I don't remember. I don't know who, whose kid you are. But amazing that the Kim Lewis name is still around. Alright, so Tigger has aged up officially to a teenager. He is a green fiend who is also... Romantic. What do we think? Do we like the romantic aspect of it? Let me get the randomizer back up. This is going to be out of 13. 10. Uh, 9, 10. Oh, okay. This might work for him. I don't know. Do you feel like this fits? Serial romantic. All right. Do you think this fits? You want to re-roll? All right, Munchkin. We can re-roll. Child of the Ocean. Does that? I don't think. I don't know if that fits him. I don't know if Child of the Ocean is what is, is going to fit him. So if we like it, we can keep it. Uh, I will lock it in in five. Oh, Sabine wants to re-roll. All right. Self-assured. That, that kind of fits. Yeah, that kind of fits. That kind of fits. So if we like it, then I will lock it in in five, four, three, two... One, zero. All right, we'll lock it in. So he is self-assured. It definitely fits better than Child of the Sea. It does. It definitely does. It definitely does. All right. All right, so you put that in there. Put that here. Oh, there's no food left. Of course there isn't. Of course there isn't. Well, you know what? You're just going to make a bunch of food for us. Uh, yeah. So, party size of that. 
then yes, I will let you go and observe the sky. That's not nearly as many gifts as I was hoping there would be. All right, you need to potty, but you also need everything else. So go play Sim Shape. How close are you? Are you very close? You're nowhere near. All right. But you're hungry, so we will have mom take care of that. And hopefully there's food by the time you're done. Where are you? Oh, he's making food outside. Hold up, 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 hold up. Okay, this child is the demon. This child is a demon. Has to be. Has to be. Okay, did y'all see what she just did? Did y'all just see this? She came over to him as he's making a salad. And all of a sudden, she starts talking about death and the Grim Reaper. He cries. She cackles evilly. Half a second later, we get a phone call saying Ronald died. I think Voldemort did him in. I think Voldemort did Ronald in. I don't care if it says he died by old age. It is not a coincidence. Absolutely not. That was messed up. That was messed up. Oh my gosh. Sims. I, I, mm -hmm. Who are your, who are your parents? Ramiro, Kim Lewis, and Catherine, Kim Lewis. Get out of my house, you, you. Death Herald, whatever you are. I, I. Yes, I hope somebody clipped that. Because, like, that was too perfect. But, like, what? I can't. I absolutely cannot. Th this game is going to is gonna like give me gray hairs or something it's determined you did thank you fearsome thank you that was absolutely too perfect absolutely too perfect all right come on now make your salad make your salad so we can feed the toddlers because the toddlers are hungry the toddlers are very hungry thank you grab a serving do you need food too you don't you need to sleep though yeah they put earwax in it and I, I i will never eat a sims salad nope if the sims ever comes out with a recipe for it Nah. Did you super fish and baby care the baby? You did. But you also need food. So come out here and get food. Yeah, come grab a serving. Everybody come eat. That was just absolutely disgusting, though. Absolutely disgusting. Come on, grab the food. Thank you. All right, well... Now that we've had a herald of death come in. Yeah, that's always fun. Not really, but okay. All right, come on. Come on, Layla, finish your food. You are so close. All right, you are so close. 
Now come back here and teach shapes to Layla. We have three hours to get her up half a skill. Come on, you can do it. You can do it. I know she has to pee. We'll let her use her diaper while she does this. We have 38%. I think we can do it. I think we can. Maybe. Um, Study shape help from mom. Yeah. Go teach shapes. I don't know why you're not. Where are you going? What are you doing? Join cooking. No. There is no join cooking. The food's already made. He put earwax in it, remember? Alright, are you gonna teach her her... Are you gonna teach? Alright, I think we are. Uh, so, uh, after 10 o'clock, then... Uh, if you age a sim up by 9.59pm that day, this kid will... To, from toddler to child or child to teen, then they will go to school the next day. If you do not, then they will not go to school the next day. They have to wait a whole extra day to go to school. So. A Netflix only has up to season 12 of Criminal Minds? I don't have Hulu. That's so sad. I'm going to have to figure out a way to watch it now. But it's going to be a while before I get up that high. Like I said, I started it a month and a half ago and I'm only on season 2. So, like, yeah, I only watch, like, one, maybe two episodes at a time. So, yeah, it's, it's a, un, it's a little known, um, rule that's in The Sims, um, that people don't pay attention to. They just age them up and they're like, oh, they don't have school the next day. Um, but I wanted to know when the cutoff was, so I pushed it. And she's not gonna make it. She wasted 45 minutes asking. So, yeah, probably not going to make it. Uh, nope, you don't get to go potty. I am sorry. Hi, Sam. Yes, we're still here. Um, we just had the most horrifying thing happen to us. Yep, we just had something very horrifying happen. Uh, you can never watch just one or two episodes of a show. So, uh, Christina, usually by the time I get a chance to watch a show, I'm very tired. So I can only sit through one or two episodes before I fall asleep. Um, and uh, Blessed blessed Batty, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the cabana. Grab a drink, grab a lunch, and get comfy. Uh, so we had... Uh, some, one of the kids brought a, a friend home from school. She came over, cack, and, um, started talking about death, made Tigger cry while he was making an earwax salad, and as he was crying, she started cackling, and as she cackled, the phone rang, and it said that Ronald died. So, I personally think Voldy did him in. There's only so long that they were able to live in a household together. Um, and Joe Kendry, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the cabana. Grab a drink, grab a lunch, share, and get comfy. That's what I am calling it. It is an earwax salad because Tigger put an earwax in the salad that he was making. Actually, hang on. What quality level is the salad? Normal. All right. So apparently an earwax salad or a garden salad plus earwax is considered normal to the Sims. I would say that that constituted being a poor salad, but... And I stand by it and said, if The Sims ever released a cookbook, I would not eat the salad. Absolutely not. You think you're glad you missed it? I think Fearsome clipped it. Yes. I think, I think Fearsome clipped it. So it was definitely an interesting thing. Definitely an interesting situation. So, yeah. Yeah. Uh, suppose a Nova Sim witnessed it. It never happened. I mean, fair. That is fair. That is fair. That is definitely fair. 
<laughs> All right, come on, finish your finish your thinking. You're very tired now, but actually, wait. Tomorrow's Harvest Fest, so you guys wouldn't go to school anyway. All right, that's fine. How do you see the clips? Um, so I bel I don't know how you see them when they're live unless um I post them in chat, but they are also in the Discord. Um, so we post them in the Discord, but then also if you come back to my channel after the stream ends, um, you're able to view all the clips. Uh, your hangry and earwax salad makes you want to... I know, right? You're so close, kiddo. You're so close. I'm aging you up before putting everyone to sleep. All right, come on, you can do it. You can do it. Ha ha ha, you did. Great. All right. Candles help mom. Tigger, what you doing, bud? Stargaze, I know you're tired. I know you're tired and you don't have enough for that. Of course you don't. It's okay, mom to the rescue, because mom does. Mom has a moodlet solver. All right, come on, Tigger, you can do it. Drink. And then go stargaze. All right. Oh, okay. Add birthday for candles. All right, so Layla has officially aged up. So she is going to be neat like her mom. Her mom is neat. All right, so this is going to be out of four. A social butterfly who is neat. I don't really have a, see a problem with this one. What do you guys think? If we like it... I will lock it in in five, four, three, two, one, zero. All right, we will lock it in. All right, you added birthday candles. She's tired. She's finally aged up. She's cute. Let me guess. Yes, class in two days. All right, so I'm going to assign this bed to you. Send you to sleep. Tigger, I'm going to assign this bed to you. Even though you're not going to need it. That's a lot of gifts we're getting for this. All right. Oh, and your skill's almost all the way up. Nice. Okay, creativity level two. What are you doing? Oh, you're making something with the activity table. Okay. I was a little bit concerned. I'm not going to lie. I thought he might have been making a mess. Thought he might have been making a mess because they do that. Get some food. All right, we put her to sleep. And Tigger, you're almost there, bud. You're almost there. Almost there. Yep, there you go. Now you're done. So, you need to come in and do your homework. And, wait, no, we want to keep that one. What's one that mom has that won't be done? Air pressure... Yeah, we'll do the air pressure one. So that way he can boost his um, his school performance. So we can then just immediately kick him out. I may go ahead and send him to school. Just We're going to have to watch the time very closely, though. And same with you. You're going to need to come. No. Instead of go play on that, just to make sure you get your skill up, go stargaze. Because, yeah, both of them, then I can get a teenager out of this. So, fun fact, you can send the kids to school on a holiday. You just have to watch to make sure they go exactly at 8 o'clock. Otherwise, it penalizes them, which is weird. And it shouldn't do that, in my opinion. But it is what it is. So. Oh, 
All right, go do that. Do your homework. Did you do your homework? No, you didn't. Where is your homework? Oh, here's your homework. All right. When you're done, do your homework. Um, and Layla Planet, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the cabana. Grab a drink, grab a lunch, and get comfy. And thank you for the lurk, Frida. All right. Come on, we can do this. And Esme, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the cabana. Grab a drink, grab a lunch, share, and get comfy. All right, come on, you can do it. You can do it, kiddo. You can do it because I know you also have to pee. I'll let you use the bathroom before I make you do your homework. I'll be nice. You're almost there. Come on, you can do it. You can do it. 94, 95, 96. Come on. Come on, flip over. Thank you. Okay, mental level four. Good, good, good. Um, mom, come up here and assist with the project. Just to make sure the project gets done by eight. Yeah. Okay, we're good. We're definitely good. So, hopefully, fingers crossed, we're able to... Um, age Tigger out and also age, um, Cujo up to a teenager. That is the current goal, guys. That is the current goal. We are going to get there. I am determined. Because it doesn't, this doesn't matter as far as, um, getting a skill up. If he gets a skill up to level two, great. But we already have a skill to level three, so it's fine. The main thing is to get the school project done. Now who's died? Nixon. I That's a grandkid. I don't care. I should, but I don't. I'm sorry. Really do not. Okay. We are going to need to go on a gnome hunt. So, we're going on a gnome hunt. I found one. I'm going to put it right here once I right, put them right there once I find them. All right. So we found one. None in the toddler's room. None in mom's room. What about the bathroom? They are peeping toms. Nope. Oh, found another one. It's the naked one. Oh, I dropped it. Where'd it go? There it is. All right, so we found another one right there on the porch. Nope. All right, what about this other bathroom? Nope. Surely they're going to give me more than two. Surely. Uh, come here, play dolls. I don't know what you're doing. Did it only give me two this time? Am I going to have to buy another gnome? I don't want to buy a gnome. Maybe it's outside somewhere. Okay, 8 o'clock. Ooh, okay. Real quick, though. We got to send them to school. Yeah, we got to send them to school. So, go to school when you're done with your homework. And then you also need to go to school. All right, that doesn't stop me from my gnome hunt. Oh, and now they're gone. You serious? Where'd they go? Oh, here they are. I've got four? Um. Why does this feel like they're about to summon something? This feels like they're about to summon something. And I'm a little concerned. The child, yeah, that child must have whatever Kim Lewis person it was that, mm, 
I don't know. I, mm, I don't know, guys. I don't know. I'm a little sus. I'm not gonna lie. It's a little sus. Are you just super efficient baby care? Thank you. Oh, and I don't... Did I even buy one of those? I don't know if I did. I don't think I have a decor thing. I might need to pop into build buy to buy one. I know I put one in the in the um Glimmerbrook house. I didn't even put it up here. All right. Okay, fine. Cujo, go to school. Thank you. Cujo may or may not become a teenager. Well, we're going to give it our best try though. All right. Let's put some decor up. Let's put the decor up because Sure. I don't remember what it's called. The attic stack decoration box. Great. We're going to stick it right there for now. All right. Mom put up. I don't want to join magic chords. All right, though. Um, it's Thomas Shelby. Thank you so much for the uh, follow. Welcome to the cabana. Grab a drink, grab a lunch, share, and get comfy. Okay, that's even creepier. I'm sorry. I, mm. Uh, good question. Did not. There you go. It's on the wall now. I did remember to update the baby count. So there's that. But has the mail come yet? The mail has not come. All right. Great. Open seed packet. Let's open these seed packets. Um, and also too, guys, if you don't know how to pacify the gnomes in the discord, in the Sims chat, there is a pinned message that tells you how to appease them at Harvest Fest. So, yeah, there is definitely a way to do that. Okay, first things first. Nope, no bath. No bath. You're going to do flashcards. Thank you. You get a bath maybe after you finish your flashcards. Maybe. Depends on how generous I'm feeling. Uh, you know what? Probably on the other hand, probably not. I'm probably just going to teach you more, more flashcards. Because if we can get thinking and potty done, then that means that we're smooth sailing for everything else. All right. Come on now. You can do it. All right, come on. Come on, you can learn it. Oh, your thinking is already level two. Well, if I can max your thinking out, that'd be great. So maybe instead of that, we'll go and we'll do this. Uh, Teach shapes. Yes, thank you for the save reminder. All right. Come on, save, please. Maybe. There we go. All right. Fingers crossed Tigger gets... I, I feel like Tigger should. I feel like Tigger should age up because we've got everything done. We sent him. He went to school, like, super close. So I'm going to say I think Tigger will. The question is, will Cujo? Because Cujo was almost an hour late. Who's trying for a baby? Trinity is wanting to try for a baby. Do we want to risk it, guys? And we're five followers away? Nice! We are five followers away from 4K, guys. That is wild. Absolutely wild. 
Um, do we want to try for, do we want to let Trinity try for a baby? Um, and Breland, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the cabana. Grab a drink, grab a lounge chair, and get comfy. Do we want to risk it? Yeah, do we want to risk it? I think we might need to do a poll for, a quick poll for this one. And thank you for that, Breland. Welcome on in. Welcome on in. Okay. Try for baby. Yes. No. Pass. All right. You got a minute to vote on this one. Tell me what you want us to tell her to do. Do we tell Trinity that she should try for a baby? Or do we tell her to pass? And word to my Crocs. Thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the cabana. Grab a drink, grab a lounge chair, and get comfy. I'm kind of curious to see what you guys want to do. And yeah, and it's a drink, and it's any kind of drink that you prefer. Your favorite drink could be literally whatever you decide it wants to be. Today, my drink is a watermelon wave. But come summer... I may think of a way to where you guys make me have a slushy on stream. I may have to come up with something like that. Does not mean that I acknowledge any slushy machines within the cabana. You have pineapple and coconut juice. Nice, nice. All right, overwhelmingly, y'all want to try for baby. All right. Really quick, though, we are checking. Because now I'm paranoid. <laughs> but she's easy to check. I just gotta look for her hair. Who's she married to? Oh, Jimmy Wheeler. No, that's fine. Totally fine. It's not It's not one of our dads. Totally fine. He's a rando. I'm happy with that. I'm happy with that. No spicy sl How do you have a spicy slushy? Is that even possible? Is that even possible? We must look this up. Oh, you can! What do they put on the, on the... It's called a, uh, Mango Nada, apparently? Um, it's Chamoy Sauce. What is Chamoy Sauce? I don't think I've heard of this. Oh, okay. Absolutely not. Absolutely not. Oh, you you guys you guys want me to like pass out. Absolutely not. Perhaps so fireball in it? I don't just I've never really been a big fan of fireball. Yeah, no, I've never been a big fan of that. You just have water. Hey, that's why I said drink, because you can have whatever drink you want. You could have, um, if you have an alcoholic drink, it's just, like, make sure it's, like, legal for you in your country. Um, just for legality purposes. Only a drink that you legally can drink. Um, and also don't drink something that's gonna make you sick, please. But, apart from that, there really are no rules as to what the type of drink is. I personally can't stand water, but that's just me. Um, no, come observe the sky. Come get your skill up so that way you can go to school tomorrow. All right, moment of truth, guys, moment of truth. Wait, are you done? Are you? No, you don't get to go to sleep there. You're going to come over here and do another shapes. Unless you got to level three, which you did not. You're so close. So close, kid. All right, but we're about to find out. Did they get A's in school. Did they, Are they going to age up? Okay, 59. Hey, okay, Cujo's going to be a teenager. Yes! The gamble has paid off, guys. It has paid off. All right, so. I found a loophole. I found a loophole. I like these loopholes. Okay. Ah, oh, you're very sad. Of course you are. 
Give yourself a pep talk. And Rosie Joe, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the Cabana. Grab a drink, grab a lunch, share, and get comfy. Uh, Tiffany's calling to chat. Sorry, Tiffany, can't talk. I've got to get happy. <laughs> of all the ways to re reject your kid, your sibling's phone call. I have to get happy so I can age up and get out. Uh, that's, that, that's, yeah. Uh, water's the only thing that really makes you feel like your thirst has been quenched. Really? I, so water for me, I don't know. I, and it may be the type of water that I have. Um, but water for me, anytime I drink it, like if I drink tap water, I always get a really sore, scratchy throat afterwards. So I tend to avoid water. And, but I'll put water in stuff to dilute it. So, all right. All right, so let's see. Let's age them up. Age them. Come on, you're almost done. You're almost done. No more black for you. Two hours, excuse me. All right, come on, come on, come on. Wait, why are you? Why'd you go up there? Come on, come on. Come on, you can do it. Okay, perfect. You're now down to very sad. Blow your candles out. All right, do that. Come on. Stop pep talking and go and go age up. Stop pep talking and go age up. All right, and then come sit on the couch. Come on. We can do it. We can do it. And All right. Tigger did a jump and a hop and a skip all in one go. All right, Tigger, way to go. Okie doke. So, self assured, green fiend, and a slob. What do we think? Do we think t Tigger is a slob? Uh, yeah, the, the animation was perfect for a Tigger. It definitely was. Do we like slob? If we like slob, I will lock it in in. Five, four, three, two, one, zero. All right, lock it in. All right, I need you to do this. All right. All right, we need to do this. Blow your candles out. All right. And you are going to be a health nut. All right. All right. All right, so this is going to be out of 13. And it is going to be 7. Okay, what is with my kids and always wanting love or money? That doesn't make much sense. All right, out of 2. Yep, fabulously wealthy. Yep, yep, mm-hmm. All right. So, do we like Health Nut for him? If so, 
So uh, this is a CC trait. Uh, these Sims are invested in their health and well-being. They gain powerful moodlets when practicing yoga and become happy when taking care of their bodies. So, all right. If we like it, I will lock it in in five, four, three, two, one, zero. All right, lock it in. All right. Oh, I'm sorry, Weathen. Uh, so basically, if you want to change a um, trait, there is a um, channel point redemption to where you can have it re-rolled. All right. I mean, I guess you kind of kept the same, same hairstyle, but... All right. Okie doke. So, Tigger, I'm going to need you to add birthday candles, and then I'm kicking you out. All right. Go ahead and do that so I can kick you out, please. Thank you. All right. So, let us move you out. I don't know if you know... You do know cat. All right, great. All right. So we have kicked him out. And yes, that is how you get a kid aged up and kicked out in under one sim day, guys. All right. Oh, Prim's hungry. My bad. Go feed Prim. Oh, 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 not good. Not good. Wait. Who has food in there? Okay, I was gonna say, you have food in your inventory. Feed, feed Prim that. All right, then I need you to come over here and make some salads. In the next house, when we go to Glimmerbrook, then we will have um, the big pot like the big pot cauldron yeah we'll have the big cauldron to where we'll make like so much mac and cheese so all right Come on, make some food. Oh, wait. No, don't do that since... Oh, well, too late. I was going to say, make a grand meal. A turkey dinner. All right. Wait. Yeah, make it. All right. Come on. Wait, where'd you put the... Where'd you put the... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Where'd you put the... Oh, there's the salad. All right. Make the food. Actually, depending on the cooking level, there's... Wait! Wait, really, 007? Cool! Cool! All right, come on, finish that, because we got to call everybody to a meal. Oh, I guess I probably should, like, interact with the gnomes. I forgot about the gnomes. And they're doing a seance again. Uh, 
All right. Come here, and this one is, I'm looking at, in the Discord to see the uh, thingy mabobber. For the naked one, you gotta give him a toy. So give him a toy for the bear. The bear and, which ones do we have? So we have the rabbit, which gets a salad. The one that looks like he's about to go flying. Um, he gets a coffee, which I don't know if we'll, we'll do that for him. The rabbit gets a salad. And the bear gets... What does the bear get? The bear gets a pie. Alright, the bear gets a pie. It just turned harvest fist. Really? That is awesome. Alright, give him a pie. I know you're hungry. Wait. Did she just make the food and then, like, go to sleep? No. Call everyone to a grand meal. Wake up and call everyone to a grand meal. So. Alright, come on. Yes, Prim. Come get food. There's food out. You're supposed to appease... Appease the gnome. Give him pie. And then I guess we'll appease this gnome with... Wait. This gnome I will give a salad and this gnome I will give the coffee. And then we'll pick up all of the uh, seeds later. So... All right, come on. Or, well, not. She's going to pass out. I mean, honestly, I've been doing good with keeping her from passing out. So there's that. There is that. All right, come on. Wake back up, please. I'm actually not that concerned about Cujo. I feel like I should be, though. Because you're very hungry, but you're not tired. Oh, you know, this could be good. This could be good. Alright, why are you, like, not listening to anything? And who broke my shower? Oi, kids. Go to sleep. All right, now that she's awake, I kind of need her to finish this salad before it goes to waste. Because I did pay for it, so. Yeah, finish that, please. Because I need something for the toddlers to eat. So, all right. Come on, Kujo, you can do this. Wait, hang on. What is your... Video gaming. Nope. You're gonna go stargaze. Yep, you're good. Go stargaze. I will deal with the rest. Go stargaze. Alright, come on. Finish up before you pass out, please. Before you pass out. Come on. All right, harvest successful. Great. And she passed out. Of course she did. All right. We're not doing too hot with keeping her awake. But I don't want to waste a sleep replenishment on her. All right. Stargaze. No, don't react to first no. Stargaze. <sighs> All right.
All right. Maybe it's 3 a.m. Maybe I can pull this off. Maybe I can pull this off. All right, level two, it's 4 a.m. I don't know. We're going to try it, though. We're going to try it. Because if I could pull it off with two kids in a row, that would be epic. I'm not going to lie. That'd be epic. Hi, Darla. What do you mean? Uh, as far as I have too few kids in the house? Or what's up? Oh, and Sam, thank you for reminding me to take a drink. A Borker is with Grandma. Yes! Borker is with Grandma, so... He is very happy. Because Mom don't matter if Grandma is around. All right, start working carefully. Mom, wake up and come help. Yes. Oh, Discord did a thing. That's all it was. Assist with a project. No, we are not casting a triplet spell. All right. Come on, you can do it. You can do it. No, do not. No. Come on. I don't think I'm going to make it. I think I'm, I'm going to need another hour. Well, we got close. How are you? Are you ready for school? You didn't even do your homework. It's too late for that now. Too late for that now. All right, come on, come on, come on, come on. I don't think you're going to do it. I don't know. Can you finish in time? Or are you too busy chit-chatting? I mean, you're already late for school, but... I would... I'm... God, okay, okay. Why you calling me out like that? Why you calling me out like that? Damn. <sighs> Damn. I was going to, but then I was like, oh, we're close to 4K. Let's just go. But, like, not if you're going to call me out like that. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. Yeah. Yeah. You say that now. Why is Newt calling us? This is a grandkid. I'm going to say yes, go for it, because it's a grandkid. I don't care about that. I just don't want them marrying one of my kids. So, yeah, I'm going to go with it. Huh. 
Oh, I was gonna say, are you calling me back to tell me that she said no? Because if so, that'd be kind of funny. I'm not gonna lie. That would be kind of hilarious. And there she goes running for the toilet. I know, they kind of do, but y'all know me in stubbornness. Alright, come on. Wait, please tell me you're not really gonna throw up and then immediately eat. Because, like, uh, then I might Ralph. Please don't. Please, please don't. I real. I don't know. My mom's a Taurus, and I'm. We're nothing alike. No, we're nothing alike. I don't know. Hold on. Let, let, let me let me ask her real quick. Okay, fair. Okay, fair. Yeah, she said we probably wouldn't have survived me growing up if I was an actual Taurus. Which, <laughs> totally fair. Totally fair. Uh, she's April. She's April, but she's on like the, the beginning part of a Taurus, I think. Hang on, now I gotta look at the Zodiacs. What are the dates for a Taurus? Oh yeah, she's at the she's at the beginning part of it. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, that picture that they chose chose to represent Taurus looks really weird. I'm sorry. Sounds like I'm saying tourist. No, Taurus. Okay, yeah, I, I hear what you mean. Okay, I hear it. I hear it. Everyone else in your house is a Virgo and it's exhausting. I'm a Virgo. No matter which Zodiac you're looking at, I'm a Virgo. I don't have an accent, though. Mom, do I have an accent? Yeah, she agrees. I don't have an accent. Oh, you're leaving? Okay, I'll call you later. Thank you. She's been playing with him this afternoon, so. Yes. Uh, we're a Vir Wait. Yes, that's right. Why it is a why it is a Virgo as well. I forgot about that. Yeah, cuz he doesn't let anyone know when his actual birthday is. Why are you going over here to ma Wait, what? Why is there water under the toddler's bed? I I don't want to know. Honest, actually, at this point, I don't want to know. All right. Uh, you have a mysterious reputation to maintain. Okay. Do you think he's mysterious? Tell tell me guys, do you think why it is mysterious? Do we think why it is mysterious? He won't let you. Okay, that is fair. He won't let you in the house. That is fair. I do have to I do have to go with that. He he is very protective of his house, but that could also mean that he's part dog. Because dogs are very protective of their house and I don't know. That would mean he's not mysterious, that just means he's overprotective. Uh, 
All right. Oh, wait. I was like, why is she not starting the yard sale? Because you have to actually click the yard sale, Bella. We have to actually start it. I don't like the blue monster painting. It's weird. And yes, we're fast forwarding until the kids come home. Lame, you went for the cheapest one. Oh, that's right. It did automatically join us. It's cute. No, it's creepy. It is creepy. All right, come on. 9K! Yeah! I will take that! I will uh, take that! Alright, come on, you can do it. Our last one, our last one. It's a masterpiece. 9.456K. All right, we can end the yard sale now. Thank you. Just in time for the kids to come home. Perfect. Um, no. Once you're kicked out, Tigger, I'm making it a new rule. All right, he didn't make it. He didn't make it. That's fine. Oh, these kiddos are very t I I don't want to I I don't want to know. I don't I don't want to know. I don't want to know. Do not want to know. We're just going to put the kids to sleep. So. All righty. All righty. Okie doke. I think that is probably a good place for us to wrap it up for today. Because, ha wait, hang on, hang on. Before we do that. Yeah, she just entered her third trimester. So we've got a, we've got a while before the next baby. So, I, I look and I see him passed out on the floor. You know what? It's okay. It's okay. But, alright, go to sleep, kiddo. Go to sleep. Did, oh, so no, it looks like, it looks like we are three away. So we are three away from our follower goal. So if anyone would like to help us hit the follower goal, it would be much appreciated. Um, but yeah, so we are three away. Oh, and Alpha B, uh, Alpha Bet Otter, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the cabana. Grab a drink, grab a lunch, and get comfy. Uh, yeah, so... Oh, did we just hit it now? Yeah, we just hit it now! Uh, even though it's apparently, like, way behind on my screen. Um, but thank you for that, guys. Thank you for that. Alright, we're gonna go here real quick. So, I, I don't know why it's... Yeah, there we go, there we go. There we go. Alright. Well, seriously, thank you guys. This is very, 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 very sweet of you. I was hoping we'd get to 4K. To 4K. I really was. Because with all of the internet issues, I wasn't sure if we were actually going to. So, the fact that we did, thank you guys. Um, and I did hear that it go off for others. So, give me just a second. I gotta do my, my snippity snip. Because I always snip snip whenever we hit a goal. So, I can share it with everybody. Um, so, uh, it was Alpha, Alphabet Otter, Charlotte is watching, and Duke Remus. Thank you all for the follows. Welcome to the cabana. Grab a drink, grab a lunch chair, and get comfy. So, yes, we hit our follower goal, which is absolutely amazing. Abs absolutely amazing. Uh, let me look and see, since we're doing the wrap. Let's, let's just look at the goals. Let's do the goal wrap up real quick. So, we hit 4K. Um, let's see. Did we hit it on YouTube yet? I don't know if we've hit it on YouTube yet. La da 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 I I'm playing with Barb too much. Oh god. 
<laughs> um, and Wilson, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the Cabana. Grab a drink, grab a lounge, share, and get comfy. Oh, so we are three subscribers away on YouTube from hitting the goal. So, um, yeah, so three. I need three subscribers on YouTube by the end of the night. Um, let's see. Did we hit it on Twitter? I don't think we did, but I haven't really been using Twitter. Uh, we're five away on Twitter, which Twitter is hit or miss. Um, you honestly, I don't know why anyone wants to follow my Twitter, but whatever. It's fine. Um, and TikTok, y'all blew TikTok out of the water. Absolutely blew TikTok out of the water. Uh, the goal was 100 followers. We are at 126. And thank you guys. These TikToks are doing amazing. And like, I didn't think anyone would want to watch my TikTok. So thank you for that. Um, let's see. And Instagram, I we hit Instagram a while ago, so... Um, yeah, we're at 328. So our goal was 325. So yeah, thank you guys. Thank you guys. It's always wonderful whenever we hit goals and such. So thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Um, but yeah, so I think that is a good way to wrap up the month. Um, tomorrow we're going to be back with more 100 Baby, and then we'll be back to regular schedule, um, of 100 Baby Elemental, and then I may start throwing in, um, some Not So Berry, and I know you guys wanted me to do, um, Stardew, so we'll do Stardew at some point. So, maybe we'll do Harry Potter Day one day, I don't know, we'll see. Um, we'll vote on it in the Discord, so, yeah, that should be fun. Um, but yeah, so... I think, yeah, I think that's a good way to wrap wrap stuff up for us for today. Thank you, guys. You guys have been absolutely amazing. Yes, Kenzie, I know. I've been pick, I've been playing Stardew on a personal save, and I'm like, dang it, now I'm addicted again. This is not good. But, you know, it is what it is. It is what it is. So, anyway, all right. Well, uh, I'm going to need to work on that spreadsheet, so that should be fun. Yeah. Yay! Uh, but anyway, all right, let's go send some love over to someone. Let me see. Um, yeah, let's go send love over to, let's go send some love to Neo. Yeah, let, let's send some love over to Neo. And, um, I will see you guys all back here tomorrow. Should be normal time. Yeah, so should be normal time. Let's, um, how do you press it in a raid? Uh, you just copy the raid message and I send everybody over. So, if something pops up at the top of your chat that says join, uh, you'll click join. Otherwise, if it says leave, don't touch it. So, but anyway, all right. Well, thank you guys. I will talk to you guys later. Um, and I will see you guys all either, um, in the Discord or I'll see you on stream tomorrow. So, have a wonderful rest of your day. Thank you for 4,000. And I will, yeah, see you guys later, okay? I love you guys. Thank you again. And thank you for a wonderful month and sticking with me through all the internet issues. So, all right. I love you guys. Have a good one. Oh, there's the link to all the socials I was talking about, by the way. Uh, so anyway, I love you guys. I'll see you guys later. Okay. Love you. Goodbye. <laughs>